All right, guys, the boys are back. Missing one boy. Oh, take our shot real quick. Come on, we got we got some shit to say today. <laughs> we got some shit to say today. Wesley, we miss you. Have fun out there. Salud, salud. Oh, Marlo, you're far, but. Oh, yeah. A little farther today, it's all good. Oh, damn. You're winded. <clears throat> a little out of breath. I was jumping around a lot. You're warm. You're warm. I'm warm. I'm ready. My boy's warm. I'm ready. All right, guys. Episode 59 of the <coughs> of the LFP. Of the, <coughs> the gang is in. I'm your host, Marlo. Wesley, you are missing today. Um, have fun out there. We're gonna we're gonna hold it down. Big he daddy, told me he was at his uh penis enlargement. Oh shit, he did. Okay. Damn. Fuck. Lucky. Yeah, I, he got chosen out of the few, right? Uh, oh, he won that raffle. That raffle that we all entered. Raffle. We all yeah, entered. Yeah, yeah. He won it. Fuck. Okay. Damn. Did this? How? How? how do, you, do we know how big? How big it's gonna go? I mean, they said it was like in between a baseball bat to um to like a a, a small hammer. You know? Those <laughs> oh, like, fuck. Yeah. Yeah. A little oh, rubber shit. mallet. Damn. Damn. <laughs> That's a. So, so he's gonna have the literal hammer. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. That's what's up. We got a little screwdriver. Yeah. Like, yeah. So That's, he won it though. Good for yeah. him, bro. That's what's up. Yeah. yeah. I mean. His recovery may be a little rough. Probably yeah. no sex for a month. Uh, yeah. Yeah. See if he can do it. Um, he is, you know, quite the, the, the young stallion. Yeah. You know, quite the young bachelor at the moment. Um, Dang. Imagine his dick don't work after. <laughs> That'd be a mission. Yo, that fam. would be. Imagine. Yo, have, have you guys seen the penis pumps where uh, when you get older and your shit doesn't work, the way to get it up is a uh, little... Like a little pump, little pump? and it oh, pumps up your boner yeah, for, yeah, yeah. for pumps like up your dick for a boner. Thing? But is it yeah. like it, it's pumping it's, blood or is it pump? It's pumping air. Oh, no, I think it's doing the opposite. Like it's like it's like a vacuum type thing. Yeah, I I don't know the details. I, I just know, know it's something about a pump. I heard, and, I heard, I heard. Yeah, <laughs> I, heard I heard from over. The, um, yeah, he knows from experience. <laughs> nah, but but yeah, I just know it's a little pump, and it literally just makes your dick a, a boner, so you can fucking sit. Um, I think you're supposed to use that once you're older. I, I saw it on Grey's Anatomy. Shout out to Grey's Anatomy's fans. Um, it's crazy. But yeah, uh, fast recovery. I'm sure he'll be next week. He'll be yeah. here next week, I'm sure. Might um, be walking a little funny, but I'm yeah. nonetheless. <laughs> Have a third leg in yeah. between him. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> Are, Are we, we going to ask to see it? Oh, yeah. Oh, off camera. camera but... Are you kidding me? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah off camera. Though. Off camera, yeah. 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 He's always, or he already... could stand right there and he could face us and do the big reveal. Oh, and then yeah. just our reactions. Yeah. I'll cut to each of our reactions. Yeah. Just like, oh. Oh, wow. yeah. And then you're gonna see George like, oh. <laughs> like fuck, you know, Whoa, come over hey. here. <laughs> What's up? What's up? Hey man, what happened? Nothing. What happened? Not you good? You good? What happened, Doug? Are you good? <laughs> oh, I'm good. I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> oh. He said, "I'm warm. I'm warm. I'm ready to go, Doug." Last week was our off week. You know, today's not gonna be an off week. Today is gonna be on week. Fuck right? with the energy, Doug. Back into back back to the momentum. Let's get the momentum back. Um, God damn. But yeah, wish good. wish wish his recovery. Fat, you know, fast recovery. See him next week. Hey, um, that motion was crazy, bro. The what? Your little motion. Oh, <laughs> the <laughs> the way you reacted. See, seem, seem experienced. Hey, you like know what that was, reminds me of? Like you remember that? when people um when they do like those like VR videos where they got the the VR set and like they yeah, yeah, yeah. they fake like they're watching porn and yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah, you and they're just like one? this. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> hey, why me. why I keep doing this and instead of this? You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're most of the time. Yeah. yeah. He's <laughs> like, my wow. instinct is to do this instead of <laughs> you know. Oh shit. Yeah, maybe like the comments are right. Maybe, maybe you know. I know, I know you. You know, yeah. Sorry, who cares? Um, yeah, you're in. What's up? How are you? Can't really. Uh, yeah. Good. How I'm, you feeling? I'm feeling good, bro. Feeling good. That's I had good. a really good week. Okay. Yeah. Today was a little rougher because of the kids. Rough. Yeah. So kids had a a bit of a. <laughs> what would the word be? Let's just say I might be getting sacked pretty soon. <laughs> I might be getting fired. Your Pochettino uh, about to get sacked at the end of the yeah, season. Yeah, no PSG. A PSG, yeah. You know. Fuck. It's okay. So for the, all of those uh, soccer fans, you know, yeah. the references that we're talking about. But exactly. Yeah, my kids uh, had a rough game today. But other than else. today, great week then. 
Other than today. Great other week. than today. Yeah. 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 Well, today is about to get better. I'll tell you that. Um, <laughs> Hector, what's good? How you doing? What's up? I'm doing good. Yeah. The, the classic twisted tea always on the on the table. Yeah. I need some refreshing for this goddamn heat, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck that. Ass. Fuck Yo. Out. Yeah, I hate, I hate to be the people to, to talk about the, the weather because I feel like that's the lowest form of conversation sometimes because, like, who doesn't know what the fucking weather is? But whatever. Um, it's fucking hot out there. It is. Holy shit. And it's supposed to rain on Monday. I was telling him that. Crazy, huh? Yeah. Today's, I think, 84, 85, some shit like that. Feels fucking hot. And then it's going to rain in a couple of days. Yeah. I mean, um, I, I, I don't mind it, though. I think it's a little crazy. But at the same time, I'd rather be this than Nebraska where it's fucking 20 degrees Celsius, uh, you know, all the time. Yeah. Um, but yeah, Wait, weather's hot. Twenty degrees Celsius is hot. Or uh, Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit. Excuse me. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for correcting me. Someone's gonna point out like this dumbass. I got you. I got you. Thank you. I rather it's just they don't know my boy Marlon is European. So he that's got true. They yeah. they're not aware of my yeah. You know Your my background. past. You know, background. Scottish. What? Where are you from? Mm. Somewhere. Wales. Welch. Wales. Oh, Welch. Okay. You know that's that's what the f- that's why I look a little funny. You know. Okay. Little a little a little bright. A little white. I did not know that about yeah. you. Yeah. You learn something new every day, yeah. you know? Yeah, that's cool. Um, Twisted T, man. How you doing? What's good? I'm doing good, bro. Yeah. My week was a little weak, but... Do, do you mind being called Twisted T, man? I feel like that's your thing, though, right? Twisted T, man? Like yeah. the Kool-Aid, man. But you're the Twisted But you're like, like, for example, fuck, Wesley's the guy who fucking always puts his legs up and shit. Okay. Um, You're the Twisted T guy. Me, yeah, gonna... I don't think we have things yet. Not yet. That's okay. We'll, yeah. we'll develop them, right? Yeah. We'll develop them. Um, George is like... The quiet, man. I was gonna that's say a nice one. I was gonna say a different word for it, but um <laughs> That's a nice one. That's yeah, that's a nice one. Yeah. <laughs> um but yeah, how do you mind you 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 accepting the twisted? Yeah, I'll be baptized with a twisted yeah. T man. The twisted T man? Yeah, yeah I, mean, I like that. Don't call me twisted T boy, all right? No, oh, no, <laughs> definitely not. <laughs> not just, the twisted T boys now? Nah, that sounds a little, a little little sus. Um but yeah, twisted T man. Honestly, I feel like one of the sponsorships I do want to get in here is the Twisty. Like, yeah, shout out to Twisted, bro. These yeah, are shout delicious, out to Twisted. bro. Any specific flavors that you don't like? Nah, they have. I mean, the ones that I, I only know the original and like the variety pack. They got like half and half. You Just, always get the variety, right? Sometimes, usually. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, so, how's everyone's week? Now that we've inter- been introduced, anything, anything new, anything noteworthy, anything you want to touch on? I mean, anything crazy. The only crazy thing is that video that we've seen about the the, the kid in the roller coaster. The roller coaster. Kid. Oh yeah, let's talk about that. Fuck. So yeah, okay. For the backstory, um, I'm pretty sure everybody's seen had, by by now. By by, by the by, time it comes out, yeah. yeah. So Monday, I, most likely people will see it. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'll show this video of this this roller coaster coming down. You said it's in Florida. Florida, um, Orlando, to be exact. Orlando, to be exact. Where are the coordinates? <laughs> uh, the longitude, latitude, <laughs> um, West thirty three, Y and X axis, or <laughs> and yeah. Um, so on the way down, some dude f- fell from the roller coaster. Fourteen on the way down. Fourteen, 14 year old, old kid, to, high school. Yeah, uh, he was a uh, he was a football player. Yeah, I guess his dad spoke on the the accident. He had oh, a bright shit. future in in football. Okay. Yeah. Fuck. Sad. Sad, sad. Yeah, that's why um, I don't fuck with roller coasters. Honestly, <laughs> I mean that's everyone's lar- like when it comes to roller coasters. That's the thing we all fear to be that one kid. Mm. Yeah, where you I mean that f- don't happen every day, but no, nah, it doesn't. But people but do die. Can. People do die from them. It happens. Um, but no, no, we never think it's gonna be us. You know, like what are the yeah. chances? Um, and I guess this uh, this specific ride, I think it came out in December or it oh, opened in fuck. December. Well, I think it was it's like gonna, the world's it, tallest. Something hey, it's gonna close in March. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's gonna close in March. That's just not gonna be over short lived. Yeah, fuck. Crazy. Um, what would you guys do if you guys were weren't obviously you guys would be dead? Yeah, but <laughs> if you guys witnessed that, if I like if I was the if kid you were next on that to him, on that ride or if you were down watching, well, from ooh, the that's video, different. If I was on the ride, I would freak the fuck out. I was like, I'm falling next. Fuck that. That's what everyone on the right, they were just like, yo, get, get us off, get us off, get us off. Like they were running to get the shoes on or some people had the shoes off. I don't know why. Um, so I guess they yo, fall. that, if you got to take your shoes off for a ride because you think they're going to fly off during. Yeah. Maybe, maybe tone it <laughs> down a bit. Like, yeah. Maybe I don't, don't make the ride that fucking yeah. insane. I don't understand that, bro. I don't understand why they make rides to the point where. Well, that's the thing though. Like it's like skydiving. Are- like why do people skydive? Some people are crazy and they like that thrill. Well, see, I do like. I'm, this is coming from someone who loves roller coasters. I love them, but damn, I have to see. <laughs> ah, damn. 
I don't know. Because that makes... Oh, man. I wish I could protest roller coasters, bro. You could what? Protest. Protest? You want yeah. to protest roller coasters? Yeah. You don't like roller coasters, then? Nah. nah. I mean, so I, I get on them, but I, I don't like them. <laughs> Neither of you guys, right? I don't like roller coasters. Yeah, I, don't, yeah. I wouldn't even get on them. Damn, yeah. And again, after that, I mean, I'm still probably going to go on them, but <laughs> I'm probably going to have to not go on some of the ones that terrify me a little more. Because there's one at Six Flags that goes all the way up and then just goes... Fru- up and like just this is back and forth back and forth higher and higher and um i can see that happening yeah <laughs> like see, i can see i'm picturing myself uh, on that bro and i can probably like, pass out yeah i mean you get you get like close. every time i've been on a roller coaster like my hands hurt because i'd be holding on tight like I'm yeah I get, I get a little clammy um uh, my forearms start cramping bro. yeah i don't know nah there's one at six flags that literally um as we're going like my head's hitting the back of this shit. <laughs> like, I can't go on. I, I, <laughs> like, it's like this. Like, it, it fucking hurts, dude. I, I, that one, I do refuse to go on now. Then you get hit by a lightsaber. <laughs> <laughs> it's not fun. Um, but again, I love roller coasters, so it's a shame that now I saw that and now, fuck, man. Because, I mean, I hate to say this, but you heard the fall. Oh, you heard no. his fall. Oh, he yeah. just, you can't do nothing. And he, he wasn't, he was still pretty high up there. He was no, still, he no. was, it was low. But it was still high. But the thing is, and you're going like, fast this far. all the energy from the way down. Yeah, and he just took it. Yeah, like that was all transferred to him. Same thing in a car crash. Even if you're going 35 miles an hour, but you're not, you're, you're fucked because it's 35 miles an hour. It's yeah, still pretty fast. Yeah. It doesn't feel fast in the car, but and seatbelts too. Seatbelts are crucial, bro. Obviously, yeah, yeah. that's why he fell because the harn, the yeah. whatever that shit is called, harness failed. I, at the end of the video, I heard someone say, "You didn't check his, you didn't check his." Uh, his harness, you didn't check something. I was like, fuck. Imagine being the worker on that. Man, that was you just crazy. like <laughs> you just caught that. You Sometimes that should be like too nonchalant, too. Like motherfuckers just come and they yeah, you know, I don't close like that. that shit. They don't yeah. even sometimes they don't even. Nah, they'll come chill. around and I'm strapped in, right? And they do like little, and I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you better fucking like <laughs> yeah, really yeah, check me. Don't give a they'll fuck. come up to my little seatbelt and just tug on it. Yeah, like nah, bro. Like oh fuck, <laughs> like tug on that shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, he wants a full service, yeah. dog. He's, he's like, he's like, check this, check down yeah. here too. Make sure I finish, dog. Come on, yo. I mean, I want to be satisfied. I'd rather have that than be that guy. Yeah, I'd rather R- have that R- too. R.I.P. to him. R.I.P. to him. That's again, oh, yeah, that's yeah, super. Yeah, when yeah. you showed me that shit, you saw the look on my face. I was like, wait, but you. So before I showed you, you never seen it before. No, I didn't know it was coming. Yeah, bro. Sorry I just saw a roller coaster. And I, sorry about that, bro. <laughs> maybe a not safe for work. <laughs> you know, you a know? little disclaimer. <laughs> you know, whenever there's something that, like that on, comes up on Twitter and IG, you get that disclaimer like uh, something, something. This is like sensitive video. Sensitive, or something. sensitive yeah. content. Yeah, sensitive content ahead. Uh, watch anyway or skip some shit like that and then you have to like click down yeah you should have gave me that <laughs> <'Cause>, bad, <bro. laughs> fuck oh because the you again you hear it you yeah, hear the fall man. yeah bro and it's not a uh it's not a sound that you want to hear you know you especially knowing that it's a human being bro yeah fall, dude. i mean i and then they all have to i mean everyone there has got to watch them or everyone's got to walk by him pretty much to get out. Yeah. Like, they just, oh man, I don't know. Those people are traumatized. <laughs> yeah. Right? I mean, you're, you're traumatized. No one on that roller coaster is ever going on a roller coaster again. Probably not. They're all telling the kids to, however they'll, yo, never go on a roller coaster. Why, daddy? Like, well, why? What, what happened? Yeah. Well, son, <laughs> you know, when I was 25, like, I saw so this. and so happened and I watched it and I witnessed it and you just can't trust it. Because, yeah. yeah. Very sad, you know. Rest, Rest in peace, peace to that guy. Um, they are about to <laughs> cash out. They Most are likely. getting a fucking check. Not worth it, the, the life, but they are getting paid. Because definitely some negligence paid apart. Um, I feel very sad for the workers who oh, yeah. are going to feel like they are Crap responsible. Um, what else can you say? You know, what else can you say? Um, any, any last thoughts before we move on? Nah, let's nah. move on. Hector. Um, oh, anything with your week? Anything with your week? Oh, uh, nah, I said earlier, but my my week was, that shit was whack. Whack? I wasn't in the gym hard, like. Uh, but you were those. there? I was there, but yeah. I was not there, you know? I was. Uh, you were there, but not there here. Yeah, not there. Your mental wasn't there. I had like 45 Your body minutes. was there, but your mental wasn't there. Yeah, I had like 45 minute workouts. Damn. Not good. 
Nah, it's still good. Nah, not for me, bro. I'm disappointed. <laughs> well, I'm proud of you, bro. Thanks. And you say, I will say, you still made it to the gym. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. That's one thing. That's one thing you could pat yourself, you know, pat yourself on the back a little bit. Oh, um, my arms are too big. I can't reach. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I hit the gym once. Um, that's why you got the, the, the. Yeah, that's why I had the, the fucking weights in here ready to go. I just. I had to warm up for today. Had to get a little pump going, you know. He said, these are the the gel edition. <laughs> hey, show them the weights. Show them the weights. Look at this shit, boy. What the fuck? Hell, that those shit from nineteen seventy four. Rusting, a little rusty, rusting away. Oh yeah, it just says five pounds, but this shit feels like fifty. Yo, right? hey, t- how much? I think it says ten, right? Yeah, well, it's ten. Ten to ten. I don't know how much this weighs though. Uh, but it's ten and ten, right? Five and five. That shit does not feel like 20, right? Well, it's supposed to be 10 pounds. Yeah, it's 10 pounds. Oh, it's five and five? Yeah. yeah. Oh, shit. But it doesn't feel like... Yeah. Right? It's, it's a lot heavier. Yeah, the iron, the iron feels different on this. <laughs> yeah, because from the, I put those on there to make it make it 20. And then I got some more to throw on. And it makes it like 30, <laughs> 35. Yeah, Heavy this shit. This feels like a 25. Yeah, right? Yeah. Damn, oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, just stop the pot. Let's just, let's just all work let's out. Just here. work out. Let's just like, pass, yeah. pass the weight around. Pass I remember this one time, like, uh, like I think it was like early pandemic. Okay. I pulled up to these foods' apartment, mm-hmm. and I remember we ordered food, and like randomly, we just all started working out, bro. Just like a <laughs> random ass <laughs> at their apartment. Yeah, like we you remember pool that bar? shit. The pull up, yeah, bar the pull up bar. We're all taking we had, and shit. We had a little mat. So we're inside like, the apartment, inside the not, apartment, not at the gym at the apartment. Bro, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think Wesley started that shit. He was like, "Hey, I'm gonna do a couple pull ups." <laughs> okay. I was like, "All right, I'm." I'm oh, because remember you guys had those uh, the little things? yeah, the little push up like whatever. Yeah, those little bars and shit. And I started doing some push ups, and then uh, Wesley put out the mat. We started doing <laughs> abs, dog, like. And we worked out until the food got there, bro. We got a nice little pump. Yeah. yeah that's we're making we're room for the food, bro. Yeah. That shit was good, bro. Someone was outside doing sprints? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just Someone kidding. as doing in Doing the ladders, bro. The ladders. Just, yeah, you're just <laughs> out there fucking sprinting and shit. Yeah. Damn. I that shit was good times, bro. I that's what's that. up. That was fun. All right, guys. Let's get to the shits. Let's, let's get to... To the shit. So... To the shitties. Uh, yeah, let's get, let's get to it. Um, for people who aren't aware, and I'm sure no one is aware except except us, um, I was getting flamed all week, right? I was getting mentioned, and well, we were getting mentioned in a lot of videos, not just me, but mostly me, right? Um, and it was all in, in reaction to the fake boyfriend video, right? Um, so I don't even know where I don't ever know where to start. How did I, that make you feel? I uh, nothing. Nothing. Uh, I'll tell you. Okay. So give us a backstory. So the video is essentially so the, the, you. It's the fake boyfriend TikTok. Yeah, if you guys so want to go watch it and you know, keep flaming, keep flaming. Yeah, yeah. I'm ready. Um, but for I, those who haven't watched it, what yeah, is the, the video? What okay, is the video? So it's essentially me saying that um, if I know what you want. Um, I'm going to pretend to be that guy. I, I can pretend to be that guy for a couple Funny weeks. Funny enough, you had the marker in your hand too when you were saying yeah. that. You I, did? Tell me why I almost <laughs> wore that same shirt. Uh, you by should, chance, yeah. by chance, not uh, even on purpose. Uh-huh. I just I saw it and I was like, "Yeah, I wear that today." I haven't, I haven't worn a couple of pods, and yeah, I was like, yeah. "That's the same shirt." And I said, "Nah, <laughs> nah, 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 nah." That might be nah, too. That would have been dope. That would be too on the nose here, you know. Um, <laughs> you would have seemed petty for sure. Yeah, that's why. Um, <laughs> or they would have flamed you for that. He's he still wearing that. Still shirt? wearing that shirt. Huh? Ain't got a new one yet. Yeah. Tell me yeah. about one of the comments where, uh, just by that shirt, I can tell he's. I'm like. Damn, God, shirt. damn, they Black got eagle shirt. eyes. Bro. I'm like, yo, the shirt <laughs> for a six cents, bro. Yeah. Like, that's the shirt. I fucking <laughs> what a nice shirt. What happened? It's a nice shirt. It's a nice shirt. Yeah, it's a, it's a little Russian. Yo, they don't know. It's all good. So um, the, the video, what is it? So is? the video essentially me saying, um, if I know what you want, I can be that guy for a couple months, a couple weeks, and then you go, oh, you know the very the plan very well, Marlo, <laughs> and then I and, and that cuts right there. Yeah, right? yeah. Um, what's it called? And people were up in arms. By the way, that that video has been up for I want to say two months, at least a month and a half, almost two months. Um, it had maybe f- I think what, it was like it was t- one hundred ninety seven thousand views, right? One hundred ninety thousand views, and I think now it's over three hundred thousand just from motherfuckers just adding and mentioning <laughs> and commenting. That video has over like I think it almost has four thousand comments. Um, That's funny. And you said, how did I feel? I, in terms of like the, the the mean shit, it made me feel nothing. Um, 
but reading some of the shit that people were saying, I was like, you guys are stupid. Like, <laughs> just not, not even just. I shit you not. There are people writing down their entire doctoral thesis Oof. in the comments. Mm-hmm. <laughs> how yeah, do you have well, the time? Ta- the thing that yeah, I never yeah. understand is that, like, how do people not understand context? Uh, to be fair, there is no context. That's why, I, though, like, okay. how, how are you, like, that's just, to me, a lot of that is, like, well, what society is now. Gotcha. Like, in terms of, like, the media. Yeah. And clickbait. Everything right, right. is clickbait. Yeah. But to be fair, I made it clickbait on purpose. I made it that way. No, Again, that's, that's what I'm saying. Like, and not because in reality, no, I didn't what say the that. video, what, <laughs> no, no, is, what is, so my, if you go back to the pod, yeah. you, there's the a keyword, video. there's a keyword yeah. that, that, that gives it away. Yeah. And that right? I cut out. And it's, and it's the if. <laughs> if. If, if. I, if I was that kind of guy. Yeah. And it, and also I say, if you tell me everything you want, mm-hmm. and if I was that kind of guy, I could use that against you and yeah. I could be that with so-and-so and there's more to it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I couldn't like that on purpose. So to be fair, I understand the the reaction. That's not yeah. the, that's not even... No, but I, my, my, my okay. whole point was like, how, like, how is easy it is for you to give your opinion on something like that oh gotcha, without gotcha, like gotcha. having context i think right, that right. that part is really stupid gotcha that's okay. why i've never really I've, i don't think i've ever commented on any post and like right. said like gave my opinion even if i disagree or yeah, even or if i agree. hate on that shit right you know? i think though okay the weird thing to me i get that it's an open space too and obviously you're in yeah no no i and that's why i'm not I'm not mad at people shitting on oh, me or yeah. commenting. Like, I, honestly, I love it because I'm not the type of person who takes that to heart. Yeah, like, yeah, I have pretty yeah. thick skin. Like, you, there's nothing you can say about me that's gonna. There's nothing you can say about me that I, I don't already know. You know, like you can't say I'm, I know I'm ugly. That's fine. Like, my hair's fucked up. Okay, go ahead. Like anything you want to say, short, fucking whatever. You, I. Wesley's I've heard all, a short one, bro. What happened? Wesley's a short one. Wesley's the. He got one. little legs. They think, <laughs> <laughs> yo, he's like a little elf on the they, shelf, though. They think Wesley's. Paraplegic. <laughs> they think Wesley um is oh they think he's five one. That's like five one, five two. He right? does look tiny for some reason. He, I think it's the chair though. Yeah. Because think about it. If, okay. I think it's the that the it's, little it, table. I think it's like this. I look yeah. smaller like this. Like because I sink in and yours, you don't sink in. Oh no, I sit kind of like that too though. Yeah. Okay. Um, what was I saying? Then you lost my train of thought. What was I saying? You're caring about people. Oh yeah, yeah. Family. Okay, yeah. The that shit doesn't. I, there's nothing you can say about me that's gonna fucking hurt you or hurt me. This yeah. is not gonna happen, especially not from strangers. That's to me impossible. Like, I why am I going going to worry about like with strangers? It just doesn't make any sense to me. Now, okay, because I've commented on TikTok videos and IG videos, but it's always when I think it's funny or something positive, right? I I I think it's crazy to me that people spend. I, I I'm not kidding you guys. At least I would say there are ten accounts. Mm-hmm. 10 accounts at least on that video and other videos now um writing entire doctoral theses <laughs> in the comments not to mention fighting with people or fighting with other people all fucking day yeah, i'm talking bro. day and night i'm not talking like a few comments i'm talking all day i see so and so commenting so and so commenting all fucking day you know so you can see the thread right and I see you can see some others like 40, 50 comments long. How do you have enough time to even do how do you shit? have the time to do that? Well, they do. I don't you know, you that. know what I've also yeah. noticed on TikTok is they always tag this uh this specific account. It's like uh, at Drew something. Drew something. And I went on it the other day. Yeah. And it's like uh, some girl that like obviously she gives her opinions on you a don't lot say, of things. Yeah. But who is that? No fucking clue. And I can't I th- isn't that isn't that some bitch shit? To be commenting this girl to fucking like come yeah, at us and shit. Yeah, like, like not to, not, and by the way, c- come at her. That doesn't, again, yeah. to me, that's nothing. But why, what's this your mom or some shit? Like yeah. these, mo- like I, I swear to you, the comments are get, get it her mom. It almost seems like snitching. Huh? It's snitching. It, it's first of all, yeah, it's snitching. But then the, the names, they call her mom. Oh, what the heck? Oh, they do? <laughs> Bro, I've seen comments that they call her mom. Come get her mom. I'm like, yo, what? Do you not have a real mom? Like, Dang, you're lucky starting a war right now, Marlo. They about to see this. That's cool. That's cool, dog. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you, I'm the wrong person to start a real war, a real war with. I can I can speak oh. and well. And I can debate and talk and come on. I'm not, I'm not dumb. I can do nah. this all day. Hey, what um, what's her name? No disrespect. What's her name? Drew. Drew something, something. dog. I couldn't. No, hey, not Drew. Are, no, 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 not, not the healthy Drew. But <laughs> it's Drew something. I can tell you right now, bro. Give me one sec. You. Drew A something. I don't know. I forget the I forget the account. Um, we would love to have you on the pod. Absolutely. Oh damn, bro. Yo, 
If you're down to come on, <laughs> come on. <laughs> My boy said he's ready for you. We'll chat. We'll chat. Hold on. Go, Go ahead. ahead. Just talk. I'll tell you okay. guys right now. It'll just um, what's it called? But yeah, I don't understand how people have time to do to that do that much. Like, that much. Like I, I understand. Like one or two, okay. Yeah, I get. You say I, something, I say something, and then. Yeah, I get a few comments. And again, I because they're not even arguing with me. Yeah. <laughs> they're, they're arguing with other strangers online, like about and it, the the it, it starts they start talking about shit that wasn't even about the video they just start talking about other random yeah. shit arguing yeah, just, yeah. just dude, tangent I, just yeah i just they take it to one point and then dude i just i could i cannot i don't have do you, <laughs> dog, i mean look they obviously have time bro that's what it seems like to me you think that's what it is that they just have the time for that yeah. yeah, I feel like there's got to be something wrong with you. I think I think that's what it is, in my opinion. I think there's something because to take your time to to write that many negative comments in a TikTok video. I just um, feel like not even, and again, that's not even ta- to me. I'm talking about they are talking to other random strangers on on the comments on TikTok. I got it. What's up, Drew A. Fualo. This is her. Well, I'm sorry if we botched your name, but if you want to be on. Let me see. This is her. You could be on. But Drew yeah, Af- going back to that Afualo. point. Going back to that point about like having the time. <laughs> hey, but I she's just, verified though, so. I don't give a fuck. Damn. Man. But what if. <laughs> I'm, not, easy, I'm not going to speak on her, but yeah. <laughs> if you have some <laughs> stuff to say, yeah. let us know. Oh, her? Well, I mean, oh, just me. because, just because, like, she has a following of these people yeah. that essentially want. But it's funny. It's, it's a one type of person, isn't it? What do you mean? I think you know what I mean. Come on. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on. Yeah. You know exactly sure. what I'm talking about. It's one type of person. Yeah. Absolutely. Bro. They hate and men. Then, it's that is what it is. They hate. Yes, sir. Dog. They do. They. It, I don't her, think it's and her that's that. okay. Like, her this, entire following is is hating men. Yeah. That is her thing. Mm-hmm. Um, and that's her following. And that's her following. And her is, followers follow us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and uh, I don't know if they follow us, but well, they're they not. Some, no, no, some of them follow us now. Oh yeah. Purposely just for that reason, <laughs> like, and I, I know because I, I can. I, again, it's a type of person. Just like, to hate. It's a very type of. It's we all know who is the. Come on. Yeah. We all see. Well, it. tell you what, bro. What's Cheers that? to our haters, bro. Cheer- oh yeah, dog. They're making us money. Yeah. <laughs> Are they not? Thank you. They're making us money, you know? It's hey, but good. shout out to them, but shout out even more to our actual... To the love. To the, to love. the fans. Yeah, yeah. Not for that's sure. who we love. We love you. We love the support. Nah, but that's okay. If you don't, you guys don't agree with us, you guys don't have to. Nah, no. No, no, no. no, no. There's a difference, though, between disagreeing yeah. and, and... Because the comment that we talked about, the fuck... Yeah. I mean, to me, Marlo. Yeah. The comment about your mom, bro. Yeah, that about, one to me. About my mom should should abort me. Should have aborted you, <laughs> yo. Like that to me, okay. bro. Like not to mention. Hold on, hold on. Okay, I would have thought lo- that was hilarious. Though. Yeah, no, but, I, I did too. I did too. I thought it was funny I'm too, like, bro. Like honestly, I agree with you. Dog. But that's what I'm saying. There's a there's <laughs> a fine line. There's a fine line between. I get what you're saying. Yeah, 100. percent Your reaction is the reaction I had. But I was like, this is fucking hilarious because someone had to take the time out of their day. To cook on our table. I like dark humor on both. Me too. Sides. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you, you have dark humor nah, to me. That's there's a funny. difference between humor. And, no, I know. Again, I know the line. line. I know the line you're talking yeah, yeah, yeah. about. I know that. I I agree. I to know me, the they line. didn't cross the line there. If they would have said that to me, what? Because you're talking about me. Nah. Because oh, I mean, we're talking about disagreeing. Yeah. Which is fine. I'm cool with you disagreeing about yeah. anything, right? Yeah, yeah. Because I'm fine. I'm. I mean, you're only gonna. You're. I'm. I'm looking at things through my point of view. Right. Right. Yeah. Now I want to look at things through your point of view. Mm-hmm. And if we disagree, that's fine. That's fine, yeah. But if you're disrespectful, disrespectful I'm saying, yeah. that's a difference. That's a difference. Okay. Yeah, I it's get the same. I get the line same. you're trying to say. I'm personally just saying that. Um, there's no line. I personally don't care. There's no. Yeah. There's no line to me. But I know. I know that because okay. Here's another thing I was gonna the say. The only line for me is like when you like if you look for me and shit and like. Nah, here, here's we're my out line. in public. Uh, and you that's exactly okay. So that's so okay. <laughs> if we want to go there, we can go there. Marlo, yeah. how many times were you added? Oh, people gave my IG. A, so that's yeah. that's essentially what you're saying now. No, nah. but you're saying in person. In person. So okay, like my, if you go out look for me and like you find yeah. me and shit, I never post where I'm at, and that's yeah. and I'm gonna keep it that way. But right, like, right. if you look for me, I'm like you're yeah, weird. Like uh, again, my I personally I feel like they can people can say whatever they want. I think they're they're free to to do that. Um, 
And your reaction was the reaction I had. Just um, laugh at it. Yes, yeah, to be honest, to me, it's just, it's just funny because okay, someone has to take the time out of day to go on the LFP IG, right? Had to go to our pictures, had to go through our ads, mm-hmm. and then find me, and then comment, right? And I tried to comment back. I tried to just say like, like that. I agree. I should. She should have, you know. <laughs> um, and I, I couldn't. I think because it was a private account, or whatever. But um, I just took. I think the reason I, I think there's no line for me is because it's all online. Yeah. You know, because I, I don't think, uh, I don't like, that's not, P, I, people love to talk tough online and say shit online yeah. because it's online. At the end you of know? the day, the online is, the internet is not a real thing. It's not a real place. Yeah, it's not a real place. Yeah, it's, it's really not. I mean, that's why I can't, because, oh, oh, let's be clear. The intent of them saying that is just to hurt my feelings and, you know what I mean? But it just doesn't. So that's why I think it's funny because they they took the time out of the day to try and to get to me, you know. Yeah, I'm just like, Dog, come on, that's not. <laughs> this isn't this isn't real life to me. Yeah, you know, this is, this is not. And not to mention, um, to to the original video, right? People don't like jokes, huh? Nah, they don't. <laughs> holy shit! People took that shit up the ass. Yeah, I have a theory as to why. Do you guys have a theory nah. as to why they took that up the ass? It's just like for one, I think for, I've said this before. Like people don't like don't understand the difference between like a space where you can joke and where you can't. Yeah, because TikTok, like you act like TikTok doesn't have funny videos. Yeah, okay. Obviously, TikTok is full of other like sometimes mm-hmm. they have like sad videos or like yeah, emotional there's a bunch videos of different, and different shit. types of content. But I mean, I, I don't think sometimes people understand what they're watching and shit. Mm, gotcha. I understand, like okay, like maybe the joke offended you. Yeah. But at the end of the day, it's always a joke. Yeah. You know, what I, I think mean? it's personal. And if you don't like, yeah, okay. and I, if you take it personal, okay, like, yeah, take because it personal. I think it, I think it's personal because they it happened to them. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was gonna say. Yeah, it's because happened to them, or they exactly know about what I was gonna it. Because okay, they for ex- take it to heart. For for example, the that drew a follow girl, right? Yeah, her entire following is people who hate men, right? Who want to bash on men, and men are the problem, right? Men are trash. If men are trash, then you guys must be fucking dumpster divers. 100%. Real yeah. shit. Yeah. You guys aren't all lesbians. Yeah. I like You guys date men, right? Yeah. Or am I wrong? Now, for the lesbians, that's a different story, right? Yeah. But you guys do date men, so... Shout out to the lesbians. <laughs> yeah, shout out to the lesbians. But even lesbians, like, are all the girls... And then, and then the girls saying, yo, by, by the end of the year, I'm going to be a lesbian. Okay. What is this a timestamp? <laughs> good, good for you. Good. <laughs> have a timeline. <laughs> yeah, like if if this is what I have to do it, then it was meant to be. You know, if if yeah. a TikTok video is what made you go lesbian, I might say a lot more about you than it does about anything else. Um, but again, to your point, they're <laughs> Call t- them dumpster divers. Damn, that's crazy. You. I mean, look, it just to me, it doesn't make any sense. Okay. And Wesley has said, it's that. like we, we've it's all like, said, but, it's like you, on, you. We've you, all said this on here. My, I don't. Just one last thing. We've all said this on here. Wesley is saying like, um, we're all trash. It's not men are trash. It's not women are trash. People are just shitty. It's that simple. It has nothing to do with one gender. I know a bunch of girls who do some dirty shit. I know a bunch of dudes who do some dirty shit. I've done some dirty shit. We've all done dirty shit. But everyone wants to act like, not, not me. I'm an angel. I wouldn't, yeah. I've never done that. I would never. Whoa, what the fuck? So, oh, so, so now we're, so someone's lying. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody. Right. Cause where are all these stories coming from? If, if you're an angel and I'm an angel and every, none of, no one's done anything right. Somebody's got to be lying. Yeah. yeah. Someone's got to be lying because <laughs> all, all we hear is stories about, oh, this happened, this happened, blah, blah, blah. She, he, this and that. Somebody's lying then because mm-hmm. somebody's doing some dirty shit. Yeah. But no one wants to own up to being or doing dirty shit, right? Mm-hmm. Um, people are just, And it's okay if you did it. Yeah. Past. People are, yo, I've, I, again, I've always owned it to my shit. Like people are just shitty. I've done shit. Um, we try not to do shit. Yeah. Right. We try to be better, or whatever, but like, Motherfucker just think everything's so binary. Like, you should just be good. Yeah. What kind of fucking boring And I've life? done good my whole life. That's for, not true. For one, that's boring. That's not true. You're telling me you just... For one, yeah, it's hey, not true. Going back to the to the post that we that we made about the racist shit. Like, you, yeah. can't, you, you can't admit to being a little bit racist at one point in your life. Dog, <laughs> come on. Then you're delusional. You're, oh, yeah, dog. Because, like, stereotypes. You, and, and any, you, any stereotype? you never walk down the wrong street yeah. and see someone, and you're yeah. like, oh... Yeah. And again, this could be Mexicans, blacks, or Asians. And white people. Because yeah. all, all we all have those fucking neighborhoods. 
Yeah, 100%. and there's always those type of people in every, every all the time. different races and shit. My my and neighborhood you, was some, all black and Mexican. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and it didn't. Yo, if I saw a certain type of look looking motherfucker, Mexican or black, you get yo, I, I hope my brother and my <laughs> friends are with me because if I'm alone, I am going the other way. And not only just races, stereotypical too. Yeah, but that's just as bad but that's as, being that's part just, of being that's like just as bad a little as racist. Yeah. Yeah. but in that, in that in that same sense, I don't think people understand the difference between like. Um, it being like hateful racism mm -hmm. or like stereotypical racism where like gotcha. you group a certain type of looking person right but not like and, and that's more so to like be safe I guess you so. know what I mean yeah, yeah I guess so so yeah. I, I don't know bro yeah cause so it don't make sense like people don't really think about like certain situations that like okay like not to mention people I think people just don't want to be honest yeah people don't want to be honest about um yeah, and going back to what you said, it, we've all done bad. Yeah, and it's gotten to the point where everyone wants to be so PC. I think it's. I think the the just the topic of being racist is we we've all we've all catered to it being like a bad thing, right? Okay, like a really really bad thing. Racism. I'm not racist to That's the for point sure. where yeah. I'm not going to hate someone. Oh no no no! Right yeah, or a specific never, group of people. When no. it's hate, that I feel like. That's when you can actually consider it racist. Yeah, that's that's when I yeah. think of racist. That's when I. You think also want to call the other stuff like the stereotype shit racist too. Yeah, but just but like, not to so that. It's my not, my yeah. thing too is that people people you don't be, always want to judge a book by its cover either. No, no, because sure. I've met like a lot but, of great people that like you know look a certain type of way. Oh yeah, yeah, and they're not like if you're cool with them, they'll be cool with you. Yeah, you know, yeah. that type of relationship doesn't percent. I mean, we've all dog look where we grew up. Yeah, we've all met somebody who looks wild. And been like super funny. And then you you just, and you, oh, they're, they're mad cool. Yeah. yeah. You know? And for all we know, we look like that to other people. Mm -hmm. Especially when we go, come on, when we when we go into certain neighborhoods, not necessarily here, but in other cities or other states. Yeah. They look at me crazy. Yeah, like, yeah. what is this motherfucker doing here? Yeah. They do, and they do the same shit to you guys. Yeah. Right? It just is what it is. Yeah. But again, it's, no, no. Everyone, no one, we're all perfect. We're all little angels, right? <laughs> um... Not everyone, but those people that think they are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. People definitely, yeah, they, they, yeah. Like, um, I interrupted you on oh, no, you were about to say something. Was it that or something else? You forgot. Um, probably forgot, huh? Nah, my point was, um, I was gonna make an analogy about like, gotcha. like we all know, like, like McDonald's is, is unhealthy, right? Yeah, but a lot of us still eat McDonald's, you know? Okay, it's that type of thing, like comparing it to like. I don't even know what my point was, honestly. <laughs> I forgot what I, I like the analogy you're, you're going with, but what, what was what the... What were we talking about what before? What were correlation? Um, I'm trying to figure that part out. We were talking Maybe about I the... I should have said that out loud. Yeah. We um, were talking about the fucking... Try again. You were making a try point. You were, you were making a point about something. I was something. making the point about... Um, <laughs> about everyone being shitty. Everyone's shitty. Like, we've all done shitty things, but... Oh, to the people that don't, like, admit. Right, okay. Like, like to that same point, like we yeah. all know yeah. that shit's unhealthy, right? But the majority of us eat. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, okay, okay, we've, yeah, yeah. We've ate that before, you know. Yeah, what yeah, I, mean? yeah I get you, I get you. But but when like you you've never not, ate, there's only like a few people who have never who have like, sort of like just, sort of like if I didn't know you, I came up to you and I was like, "Yo, you eat McDonald's?" You're like, no, what the fuck? Like, I don't eat that shit. Yeah, but I've made but McDonald's you, at least bro, once. You've, once you've eaten life. it, like you've you've had right. it before. that type of thing. Yeah, yeah. Or yeah. like I've been vegan my whole life. Oh yeah, but. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you like, bro? You sure? You never. Had you like remember that. when you were four or five? Yeah, or like, yeah, like yeah, come yeah. on. Um, what? Where? Where else can we go? I mean, I got a lot of points. Any? You guys want to ask me more questions? Come on, get, get me going. Get me going, guys. If more, what, I, was, I, what, what was your favorite video? Damn, my favorite one. I think it was the one that. I think the one that Bochis sent me. Or the one they sent all of us. The the one that you're not a twelve. Oh, the book one, the, the 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 girl who writes books. She had a book. She that had a book, crazy. and she said, she said, uh, fucking book. Yeah, she's like, oh, got the motherfucking. Book. Um, but I don't think you're a twelve, Marlo. And she just kept going. I, I thought that was funny. That was actually pretty good. I was, I like that one. <laughs> yeah, she goes um, in on you, boy. Yeah, we might, she, we might get your book. <laughs> no, no, we're not. Nah, we might get it, bro. <laughs> no, <shot>. Why not? <laughs> what? We'll put it on our shelf right here. Yeah. Okay. I mean, you want to buy it? Go for it. You know, I mean, I'll hang it up behind you if you want. <laughs> Um, frame that shit. Frame that shit. So what? Is, so I What's think that? that book entailed. Oh, we're not gonna sleep or be with men until. I think no. I think her thing was no kissing for three months. Yeah. No month. Yeah. Yeah. Oh damn. My. Three months. Three months. Dude. Kissing. Kissing. Yeah. A kiss for a peck. Are you guys? By the way, hanging out hey, with a girl. By, by the way, <laughs> are you guys hanging by, out with a girl that yo, doesn't kiss you? It, for three no. Months? No. 
that's come on no absolutely no, it's not just no what the fuck if, yo wait, hold on hold on if you got a if you got if i meet you and you have a stupid ass rule like oh i can't kiss for three months oh that's, that's it dumb. for me i'm good she's i don't a, care she's not gonna tell you that though okay but there's can, some girls that do i, I think i think those girls who read that book and who do that will tell you yeah yeah and even if she doesn't let's just say in your scenario she doesn't then you get the hint you try and kiss her she's like oh no all right well then that's it too but i feel like just, i feel like if say say that word the situation and uh, i go in for a kiss and she tells me no i think that kind of tells me oh like you're not interested cool then versus yeah. versus uh, you have to wait let's just say in the perfect scenario let's say she told you about it the book then oh. let's, let's just told you let's just say let's just say she told you the 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 rule is oh you know what i actually don't kiss for three months they just say she told you that in a mm-hmm. perfect world she said that you're done right yeah come on well not only that it, it's see and this is where it ties back to that scenario that you're saying right yeah. what if i wait the three months and i kiss you or what if the three months were i'm not i don't have sex for three months yeah then maybe i'll wait the th- three months right mm-hmm. and have sex with you and then i can just bounce same shit it's the same thing. It's a fu- I mean, There's th- a timeline to this, dude. This is my thing about the mo- the majority. That's the thing. The 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 comments that were at me, you know, or at us. Let me. The, the ones that were, that were don't forget, right? The comments that were at us or at me that were trying to be so hurtful impossible. made. So, uh, come on, Hector, write that shit down. <laughs> didn't did not they did nothing for me. The comments that were stupid in logic, in common sense, and were completely just irrational. Those are the ones where I like. This is really how people think. Yeah, this is insane. Like this is crazy. Cause to your point. Yeah. Your rule's three months. Okay, cool. <laughs> if again, if I'm and I may, I'm gonna pretty much make a whole new reel again. If I know that and I'm that type of person, <laughs> right? And I'm a sociopath as everyone called me, right? I can just fucking wait, do that and bounce. What kind of stupid shit? Yo, be a be a better judge of character. How about that? Yeah. Be and yo, you know what? exactly and by the way by the way exactly you know what they'll say oh but then still they well then fuck dude that shit happens get the fuck over it yeah you don't think i've ever talked to a girl i'm like yo this girl is great see and we get along and then it ends up like yo so with some time went and she just ended up not being interested in me now it's all about her yo shit happens yeah Yeah. i'm not saying yo she played me even if you put yeah even if you put a a time frame in something like that that doesn't mean like people are gonna have the best interests in mind for Nothing. you it means yeah like those be like even if you starting to talk to somebody like don't ever think like that person has the best interests in mind for you like nah. for what you have going on like yeah, yeah yeah a lot of times like when you start talking to somebody like you're still gonna be all about you like you're not gonna you're not gonna give, give yourself it, up yeah you're or not give gonna what do you that. got going yeah. on just for and yeah you, and at the same time like from the other side like you shouldn't expect that from that nah, person nah, 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 not and I think that's where people make the mistake. Like, yeah. if you want to establish something in the beginning yeah. and be like, hey, like, I want to be exclusive much and shit, different. That, that's much, much different. different. But if you guys have never talked about it, you guys have get, barely getting to know each other, like, you can't expect, like, and you, you know why you I don't say that? that? I feel like we've said that so many times. I don't, I don't want to be redundant. Because I feel <laughs> yeah. like we've said that almost every fucking episode. Yeah. If you say it, if you say, yo, this, this, and that, okay, cool, we're good. It's clear. We're exclusive. We've made the line. <laughs> if we haven't, stop tripping. But... <laughs> So your you, what was your first thing? Oh yeah, no, no your thing. Um, that oh the, the time thing, right? Um, why what what's why is it three months? Yeah, why is it three months? <laughs> why is it ninety days? Why is it two? Why is it not six? Why is it not a year? Why not just not have sex until you're married? Might as well, right? Why not? Just, oh, by the way, some of the comments. This is this is, pretty, this is gonna be the one fucked up thing I'm gonna say this entire time, right? Um. Because I told myself, I'm not going to say anything fucked up about people, right? This is the one thing I'm going to say that's fucked up. <laughs> Some of the people were saying like, oh, I haven't dated for a year. This is why I've been celibate for two years. That's not why. You don't have a choice. No one's trying to sleep with you. That's what that is. <laughs> no one's trying to date you. It yeah. has nothing to do with, oh, this is why. Because men are, no, no, no. Men are interested in you. It's that simple. <laughs> don't masquerade your, your celibacy or your fucking non-dating for oh because men are trash or, or people are tr- whatever no 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 one wants you damn if i had that's the, the, if i had the ipod gun the air horn, the air horns <laughs> and the gunshots that's the one fucked up thing i'm gonna say you don't have and is it because they're crazy i nah. it's a myriad it's a myriad because of what if she's bad no no it's a, I, i'm saying it's a myriad of things it could be for for one for the comments and the shit that i heard some of the things i read i was like yo you're just who the fuck would even want to? Because hang yeah, out with you? exactly. If Not a girl, to, but you know what I'm talking if about. If a girl's cute and she's like that, 
Oh, I'm, I'm then done. I'm I'm out. I'm good. Yeah. I don't. I, I've I've messed around with a lot of girls who are cute. Um, and I was like, oh, they're like they're I, just upon seeing, I'm like, oh, I, she's okay. Like I'm interested. Yeah, yeah. And then I hear them talk, or we have a conversation. I'm like, okay, I'm good. Yeah. You and I'm sure they've done that to me too, right? I'm sure. But again, I've had that where I'm like, oh, she's cute. And you speak to them, you're like, yo, this girl's dumb nah, as rocks. but it's not with you though, because you're not like that. Well, yeah, obviously, I'm, I'm just but saying. What I'm saying is, yeah. a girl that is cute. And right. you go up to them or you, you're you interested in them, whatever, you guys go out. Yeah. And she starts talking like men are trash. Then you're turning me off. Oh, 100%. You're turning me away. Yeah. I'm not going to fuck. I'm not going to mess with you. Yeah. Because see, that's the thing. I don't. The one thing that I don't understand, too, is how are you, especially that, that Drew, whatever girl or whoever the fuck is out there doing this dumb shit. Why are you like proclaiming that men are trash and shit? Why is this cool? Bro, you're like 25, 30 years old. Grow up. Yeah. <laughs> like this is what you're putting on people that men are trash like you don't yo you don't hear me saying women are trash i've never said that have i have we yeah. i know our boy once said that shit as a joke <laughs> right but other than that like we don't say <laughs> and that he didn't shit. say women are trash he said women are bad people yeah there you go not Same, good people not, not good, good people. people yeah yeah um, but again a fucking clear joke right yeah clear fucking joke um but again i i well, I'm not going to, it just, to me, it's a weird thing to go up on your platform and just talk about how men are so fucking trash. You date men though. So what does that say? How about does that you? work? How does that work? You know? Yeah. What kind of men are you dating? Not to mention like, isn't that, I feel like that's a negative thing to put on girls or to people in general, isn't it? Like, yeah. for example, let's say we, if, if we have daughters, right? You're not going to tell your, your daughters like, yo, men are trash. That's a bad way to raise them, right? Yeah. You just want to tell them, yo, this is how things work. Be careful, blah, blah, blah. This is how you should respect, whatever, you know? But to just outright, same thing. If I tell my, if we had kids, right? Son, whatever. Yo, women are trash. And to that point, mm -hmm. like, it just, when you, you're, you're when you say them. shit like that, like, you you're teaching them. You're already, like, not having hope. Yeah. Like, for, for society to get better. 100%. But at the same time, like, it, like we've known like society gets better over time yeah and it takes a long time bro. i hate when people i hate when people say oh things were so much better in the 1900 in the 1950s so like for real like motherfuckers were still yeah, yeah they were doing like it shit was rough you know for, for, it was yo yo it's yeah a, like, it's a little better now i hate when people say oh so much better um in this when the america was founded i was like I there think, were slaves dog what I are you talking about i think the reason they say that is because in terms well, of we know romance, in terms of romance and all that stuff yeah. people had to like write love letters and it's more yeah it's more special but yeah they had no other fucking choice yeah exactly they didn't have phones bro not to do things things evolve at one point yeah. even then like you don't think that motherfucker was sending a bunch of those cards yeah. to different guys? that was like, copying and pasting and saying the same shit to three four different girls bro. there was yeah. three nearby towns he had a hoe in each one here's one, one, yeah, one reference bro. i'm gonna make about the stock market as you guys know you know my, we me and boys used to have a little little house rules thing um the game never changes the game is the same the game just yeah the game just uh the the surroundings or the inner work it's just that evolves yeah right but the shit that we're doing now um because people love to say oh it's so chivalrous back then mm -hmm. you're probably right motherfucker was probably sending out three um three male, or four letters three letters to, to fucking same Sally shit every time bro come on though it's, you send he, us he had four pens like taped together bro <laughs> just wrote at the same time yeah like these the same the same tactics we use now I'm sure we're used hundreds of years yeah, ago. Yeah, they just evolved. Just in a different form. Yeah. yeah. Right now, we're texting bitches all the... You know what I mean? <laughs> but back hey, then... I know about... Hey, me and my boy right here. We no, not me. But, but obviously... They were the found, we don't, I, like, <laughs> yo, by the way, I'm ne I'm going to stop making a disclaimer for you because we all know now. No, I have a girl. My girl. That's what I'm saying. That's, so that's baby girl. I'm, I'm going to stop making the, the, yeah, yeah, the yeah. thing. No, not yet. Because nah, nah, nah. who gives a fuck? We, are, we know already. She knows. She knows. Like, we're all... That's The reference is not to you, obviously. And not only that, you know what? you know what I also think about is... They they wrote the book. Yeah. They wrote the book. We Somebody just, passed the shit down. Yeah. We just you've continued to to make little tweaks and you yeah. know, continue to better it. So now they're yeah. saying that it, and I mean and, and going back to the whole men are trash, isn't that also the equivalence of being racist in a way? No. Because you're you're hating one group of men, I get what one you're group it's, of people. That's yeah, prejudice, no? Um, Sexist. Yeah. I'll be honest, I don't want to throw the word out there because I don't know it, but I know what you mean is that if you're racist, you're 
you have hate towards this one we're not a race group. though we're a exactly so gender, gender. Yeah, yeah but yeah. i again, that, that's no, but i'm just saying like just that's the, the same concept yeah, that you're yeah. hating one set of group a uh, one group of, one group yeah yeah group. um and you and bust them why, all together i think that's the issue and that's why i think it's weird that this girl and other girls like her um have this following where you hate men i get i get that they're that's talking about i think is weird the thing is to me also like they, I know they're talking about a specific type of man, but at the same time, you can't say like, and just like say, everyone in that group is that. See, way. look, all oh, men are. Trash. I'll make this distinction. We in here have said, and I have said, women this, women that, right? And I've said when I speak in that generality, I don't mean all of them. It's just I'm not gonna every time say so. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I'm not gonna do that every time. So I know when sometimes they say, but I've seen specific comments and specific videos that say all men, all men. All men. So if you say all men, I have to take that literally. I'm not going to take that out of context and, no, you know what? They must have met, you know? Not me. Not me. Not Come on. Me. Yeah. Can't be if me. you say men, I get that you're doing the same thing that we do sometimes. What we yeah. just say in general. I know you don't mean all of them, but I've seen specific <laughs> comments in video where you say all men. All yeah. men. I'm like, oh, all right. Then. Not only that, we we would say all but then we correct ourselves. <laughs> we and we're like yeah. We're like most. Yeah. Most. Some, not Some. all. Yeah. And again, We're not in. We're not here giving. Like I'm not here. Uh, for t- we're not here to hate women. No, that's fucking. I think that's weird. We're here to talk that's about our experiences. Fucking, I think that's fucking weird. We're here to talk I, about our experiences and what we see and it, what we hear other people say. Exactly. And I and again, they are literally saying how they hate men. And I've seen. And not to. Oh, and to be fair, there are dudes who do that too, who say they hate women. And how women are so fucking this and that. And don't... Tr- and no, well, hold on. Don't trust women. Don't do this. Don't do that. You guys haven't seen that? I've seen it. Yeah, but it doesn't think, happen as often. Nah, that's, I, I disagree. I see... Well, I, I don't think, see it. I'm just saying I okay. don't see it I'm see, I, Well, I'll tell you. I'm seeing that shit everywhere. I see it, but I'm I don't see it I'm seeing that shit often. everywhere now. I think it's, it's become a popular thing to hate women now. The same way it's been a popular thing to hate men, it's becoming a popular thing to hate women. And to bash women. Don't trust them. Don't... They do this and that. You know what I mean? It's become a thing to do that. Mm-hmm. And they talk about it in awe. I feel like the thing... I've seen things where they try to make... Like, they ask questions. In the same way how we say there are exceptions. Yeah. Some, not all, right? Yeah. I've seen these same people confronted or um, or asked. So you mean some though, right? You yeah. don't mean all? And No, no. Their response is, no, all of them. No. I'm like, bro, you're fucking weird. How are, yeah. how are yeah. you a 40-year-old man... I remember I replied There's to one specific up. guy on on TikTok. I don't know his name, and I don't want to bother looking at it or yeah. looking him up. But he is like anti women. Yeah, I don't. And, I don't and it's not just him. The guy, and I think I know who you're talking about. Um, it's a black guy. I don't know if he's black, but he's dark skinned. Yeah, I think I'm pretty sure he's black. Um, yeah. But point is, I, there is him, and there's a lot of other people like that, and there's yeah. a lot of the podcasts like that. A lot of the dudes talking. I'm like, yo, you're fucking weird, dude. Yeah. You're fucking weird. Yeah. What are we do? What are we doing? You mean you at hate, this point? It's just whatever. like a you take a jab, I'm gonna take a jab. Yeah, it's just mad, and that's we, what happens. Like when it happens, like yeah. over. Okay, like I get like you do it every once in a while, but if you like dedicating your shit to that, then right. Then, and I agree with you. You're fucking weird. Like you're just causing more hate. Like it's just I don't know because bro. I think it's because we got it's clear. It's, to there's me, a fine it's line, like the same shit. There's as a like, fine line, right? Liberals, yeah, and right. what's the other fucking side? Democrats. Whatever. Where are you going with this? There's far, see. far right and far, far left. Left. Okay, yeah. That's what it is. Oh, you're saying like wh- people who hate women and people who hate men. Okay. And there's the middle. Yeah, yeah. I just again, I, I think there's also a clear distinction. Extremists. In what we, extremists. extremists. On that's, what side, yeah. that's what it is. I think it's weird because I think our shit's obviously for fun, dude. Yeah. You know what I mean? And I think that's the thing where I go. Sometimes I've seen it on other platforms and content. Where oh no, they're not kidding. Mm-hmm. They're 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 serious. It's clear. Yeah. Come on. They mean it. And because that's coming from me, who I am a rational person. I have common sense. So I can I can safely say I can tell. Right? And I think it's clear that we're just fucking having fun and fucking around. I think that's also the, the, the difference. Yeah. Is that some dudes are really out there like giving like, no, no. This is what you need to do. And this is the best advice. Like, I'm dead serious. Oh, mm-hmm. see, that, Whereas, part, that part is 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 where I draw the line. Gotcha. Okay. Like I would list. I listen to people's opinions. Gotcha. Obviously, like 
when they even when they say that like oh like some like women will do this right and and I don't always take that like like serious but I consider it you take like uh, you take it out in a as a grain of salt that's the answer phrase yeah yeah with with a grain of salt yeah like okay. I don't okay I was like okay yeah that that can happen mm-hmm. in a situation and and I feel like people like who like follow it to the teeth you know, like yeah. especially that that lady that we talked about earlier that wrote a book. If you're reading her fucking book and like taking that shit as a manual, like yeah. you, you you're a fucking. That's clown. what I'm saying. That type of bitches, the type of bitches who, who <laughs> read that shit. Um, what, you guys laugh when I say bitches or what? Yeah. In that, it, I was, I was, I'm gender fluid. I was, a, I was a woman in that moment. Yeah, yeah. I can do that. That bitch. Yeah, I was, I was bitch. and I'm, I'm back now. I'm a guy. Oh damn. You could do that, right? In third person. You could do that, right? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Gender fluid, dog. Damn, he did sexy YouTube. Bro. Yeah, what? How you do that shit? <laughs> Show me, dog. Every time I turn into a girl, I'm gonna just start doing that shit and yeah, yeah. call call girls bitches because you know because you again there's women right there. Yeah, I can do it. Right, that's the rules now, right? I didn't know. <laughs> oh, you weren't aware? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You can identify oh, you can. yourself. You can identify yourself. Oh yeah, one minute I could be a guy, next next minute I'm a girl. That's crazy. I'm about to go in a girl's restroom. <laughs> oh. I identify. Oh, you're the motherfucker people are scared of. <laughs> JK, JK. The, uh, JK. He's like, he's like no. When in, when in mode. There. No, 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 no. You're Let the me. motherfucker people are scared of. Hey, before he gets in the bathroom, he's going to do his little yeah. six jitsu thing and come back out. Oh, oh fuck dude, here. That came out. I found like George, bro. Fuck that. I, I apologize don't let for my George, statement, dog. Don't let George hear that shit, bro. Because yeah. he would be that. I mean, oh, yeah. Let me take be... back my statement. <laughs> nah. Hey, he's going to be That's in the real. bathroom. <laughs> That's a real. That's a real. <laughs> <laughs> he's, they're going to come for you next, yeah. dog. Yeah. He's going to cut it to the point yeah, where yeah, exactly I'll make that shit look like, real bad. <laughs> um, what's it called? But yeah, he's going to be, George is going to go to the bathroom like, I'm a girl. What do you mean? I'm a girl right now. <laughs> Disclaimer, uh, and, I'd never do that. Hey, hey, <laughs> hey funny enough, in, Me- in Mexico, bro, it was my uncle's wedding. Yeah. And I had a lot to drink that day. A lot to drink, okay. right? As as you should. Like, fucking yeah. Mexico, out and there. I was having a good time and shit. And he was like, oh, I got to use the restroom, right? Okay. And I remember I just walked in, bro. And I... <laughs> And funny enough, like I started looking around, <laughs> I just started seeing like little girls and like grown women. I was like, "Oh shit!" I turned oh. around. Oh, you in the wrong bathroom? Yeah, I went in the wrong bathroom. Though. I turned around so quick. I walk outside. I see my cousin Alex dying, bro. <laughs> oh, he, he was didn't... laughing. Did he know you were going in there? I guess he said he was just looking at me, and I walked oh, into just walked the wrong... in there. Yeah, bro, I did I not. I turned yeah, right I around. Told you I was either. like, God, I let your ass go in there. <laughs> well, I saw, you know, yeah. and I told him too. I was like, Why the fuck didn't you tell me? He was like, You were too far. I yeah. couldn't. The music yeah. was too loud. Like, <laughs> I couldn't save you. Dog. I just saw you. Bro. Were they looking at you crazy? I would have looked at you crazy. Yeah, when I walked out, they're like, Oh, like, yeah, and I was like, Fuck. I just put my head down. I walked to the other side to the where. So the... it's not it's not like that out there out there yet. What do you mean? Or you just like, yeah, I'm a, I'm a woman. No, I can. Uh, not yet. Nah, that was like 2018. Oh, nah. Yeah. Definitely not. Yeah, that nah. was, They that's... were about to execute you. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I should have went home. <laughs> I should have went home. <laughs> they were about to get the bounces on you, dog. For real. Nah. Yeah, I lost cool. where I was for a second. Yeah. And I, as soon as I was like, damn, I did not go into <laughs> the, right, the right play. It's all good. It's an honest mistake, you know? Yeah. It's an honest mistake. Um, so, okay, one other thing. Let's keep going with this shit. We, I, we, I am not done, motherfucker. We got a lot to fucking say. Damn. I got a lot to fucking say. I got a lot to... Okay. Say it, Online man. bullying. What's up with that? I thought it wasn't cool to do that. It's not. Right? It's I not. thought it wasn't cool to online bully. Yeah. Right? You, to me... I thought, just, hold on, hold on. I think half of the motherfuckers commenting on videos and doing this shit, I guarantee you, are the same motherfuckers saying... No, you shouldn't bully online that people. That's going to lead to suicide. That's going to this and that, blah, 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 right? Yeah. The, to me, the <laughs> I distinction. That wasn't cool. Yeah, the distinction. I'll tell you from, what. I was being online bullied. Yeah. Now, you I'm, were. A, I'm a different type of person. So it didn't, like, it didn't um, affect, affect me in that type of way. Um, that's why you're getting into this content right now. Because yeah. if I was hurting, yeah, I'd be like, yo, I can't talk about it. Like, I'm yeah. down, dog. Like, it's fucked. Like, people were saying this and nah, bro, I don't give a fuck. But somebody else, I guarantee you, somebody else was that person. And then they'll be grieving like, oh, like he was online bullied, and but you were the one who was doing it. Hey, you were doing it. Thank you. You were doing it. You You're the it. cause of everything. You said it, not me, right, bro? It's, Come on, keep talk. It's it's only like they only care about you when you're gone, bro. Okay, but during true. the moment, oh, 
I'm about to do it. I'm I, yeah. I'm part of the problem pretty much. Yeah, hundred percent. So right now, like with that whole situation, bro, with you at least, yeah, that's fucked up. Again, uh, I'm saying because again, because I'm me, like it's not gonna do anything and it's not gonna result in that and it's not that type of thing to me, right? But if it was somebody else, right? I thought it wasn't cool to online bully. What say happened you are, that? Say you were a different person though. Yeah, if I was, yo, I let, let's just say I something might happen. Yeah. They were not saying nice things. They weren't flattering, right? Yeah, nah. Bro. They were not flattering. Very see, mean. But again, see, I feel like that's the big difference between like, because I feel like people would try to say like you were bullying people, but that's not the case because that's not the case. The, I, I feel like the big distinction there between like online bullying is when you come at a person like personally. Yeah. Okay. And what we that's do fair. here, we just state our opinions about like like Yaya was saying, like shit that's happened to us, like yeah, experiences, our experiences, or like opinions on just whatever dating, what's or, going on, or what's yeah. going on in the mm -hmm. world. And I don't know, like people, I, I I just don't think like people understand that distinction. Like they they just cause more hate, right? No, for sure. But the, again, I mean that's good for you because I because yeah. I, I've seen comments like making fun of me and like the yeah. way I look, and I think all that shit is funny. Me too, yo. Yeah. I that's and that's why. Um, because, for example, if I thought that Wesley would be upset about the shit they said, I wouldn't say it. But I know he's not telling that. Same thing for me. That's why I can talk about it and say this because I know we don't feel like that. We're not going to. Our reaction is the, the fact that they think he's 5'2 and he has paraplegic legs and, and he's this and that. I can say that because it's not going to affect him. Because I know and even he's, if I reply, like, I'm not going to, like, like, I'll take it as like, oh, you say a joke about me. I'm going to say a joke about you. Yeah, I can I can see that. I don't I, I don't do that. I just kind of laugh just because I, I genuinely think it's funny. I do like I really do laugh. But I'm saying more um, so in person. For, yeah, in person. Yeah. And um, I seen this shit they said about you. I seen this shit about you. Um, and again, I just think it's all funny. And I think it's because we're not that type of person. Right. The yeah. only people that I care about how they talk to me or how what they say about me is you guys. Yeah, it's my us, family, family. Yeah, my girl. Yeah, that's, that's it. That's really all that matters. And that's, that's it. That's why I think. Oh, okay, so this this kind of touches on to the next topic, um, but I don't want to get off of this one just yet. Um, but people are so afraid to put themselves out there. Yeah. People don't want to put themselves out there to do a fucking gym uh, IG. They don't want to, uh, uh, what's it called? Uh, fitness IG. They don't want to do fitness IG. They don't want to do YouTube videos. They don't want to do podcasts. They don't want to do um, uh, social media content. They don't want to do TikTok because they think people are going to say, oh, you're fucking dumb. You're fat. You're ugly. Um, you're not even funny. Um, who the fuck is going to watch, blah, blah, blah. People are scared to do shit because of that, right? That's why people don't put themselves out there. They are so afraid. They're, they're, they're so afraid of the criticism. Yeah, I've, I've seen comments like in our in our shit that says like, they'll, they'll reference like Joe Rogan. They're like, oh, like they see Joe Rogan as a su successful podcast. Yeah. Not everyone wants to have a mm -hmm. podcast. Yeah. But I'm like, that. that is the stupidest <laughs> shit. Like that is the stupidest <laughs> mentality you can ever have. It's yeah, just yeah. like, it's like if we're out in the street we yeah. see like a millionaire, like in a nice, like like a McLaren or something. Yeah. Like, damn, like I, I wish I was him. And like, let's say I try to be like like him, and yeah. like that's like you criticizing me for wanting to be a millionaire. Yeah, no, no, like that's so dumb. Like, why are you even gonna think like that? You, you see somebody who had like yeah. who is successful and yeah. shit. Like, isn't would, that good? Why, that's yeah. good. Yeah, like you, are, you should be happy that I want to. Yeah, like what the fuck? Like, myself, me or do myself some, as do a something successful different. person. Yeah. yeah, yo, Joe Rogan is literally the I would say the largest media outlet. Yeah, as like, a one fucking person. Yeah, yeah. Why wouldn't you want to yeah, be like I, him, bro? I, that's like looking at a pro athlete and be like, I want to be just that's like. That's what Messi. I was gonna say. I want to be just you know like. What's fucking Kobe funny? Um, the you, uh, when Messi became a pro, no one said, "Oh, he's some Maradona play." So now he just wants to be like Maradona. Yeah, bro. He's why not? The go. Like, what do you mean? No one looked at Ronaldinho and said, "Damn, motherfucker, just want to be like Pele." What a fucking bum. Yeah, dog. <laughs> he's the greatest of all time. So sounds about right. Yeah. No one, this makes no fun. That comment to me was, for one, I thought was a compliment. Because the yeah. fact that you even mentioned our name with that dude, bro, yeah. we're not even close to that right now. Yeah. And you, that's what you think of, bro. What? Good. For, Good, good, good that you're, yeah. So Joe Rogan is being compared or, or we're, we're being, being compared, compared to, Joe to Joe Rogan? Rogan? Oh, for sure. Bro. Give it to me, dog. Bro, Joe Rogan. I love you, dog. Yeah. Cheers Undeservedly you, so, but give it to <laughs> us. I don't give a fuck. Oh, yeah. But the fact that that's even what comes to your mind, bro. Yeah. Good for us. You, and you thought that was an insult? Hey. Yeah. Good you for mean, us. Yeah. Good for us. Not, the biggest um, podcast deal in all time, money-wise. And that's your... Thank you. Yes. <laughs> I would love that. Matter of fact. Yeah. Why not? That's but so that's again, the that, shittiest mentality. I just think that's ever fucking had. funny that it happens with this and other type. Same thing with people um 
And this doesn't, uh, like, if you're a YouTuber, oh, you just want to be like Jake Paul. Or, or Mr. Beast. Or Mr. Or... Yeah, bro. He's the biggest YouTuber. He's making hundreds of millions and doing fun shit, cool shit, having a good life. Yeah. Why wouldn't I? That makes no... That is the shittiest mentality the, you could ever it's, have. It's a weird to shit on people for wanting to do something different or fun or cool. Or shoot for the stars. A shoot for the... And not... Just the... This is the way I see the... the like you said, the mentality of people really starts to, to shine through. Yeah. Who thinks like this? Damn. I have... Damn. I have... I don't look at, I just have never looked at people like that. Like that's, uh, for example, people want to be, we have, we have people who want to be, like we have uh, people who we are acquaintances or we know, or people who watch this podcast so want to be singers, artists, rappers, whatever. I don't go, oh, what a fucking bum. He wants to be like Drake. Or producers. Or a like, producer. Yeah. Yeah, I'll dog. Never Good for you. That's like cool. Them. Like, okay. Why Work would I shit on that? That makes no sense. And not only that, compare and act like comparing him to someone that's putting like you huge down. is putting him down. Like, bro, what the fuck? Yo. If you ever compare me, I love soccer. Yeah. If you ever compare me to fucking someone big, I'm like, all right. If, yo, if, if I would have said, uh, damn, yeah, you, you want to be a pro? Like, oh, you, you just saw fucking uh, Ronaldo play, huh? You just want to be like him? You're fuck, You're a loser, dog. You'd be like, damn, you think I'm like a Ronaldo? <laughs> you think I can be like him? Yo. For sure. I'm, I'm yeah. gonna train harder. Actually, I do want to be like. Yeah, that. actually, yeah, I would love that. that What's makes wrong with that? Not to mention, not to mention, um, being inspired by someone who does great things, which is kind of what a lot of this is. Not just us, but podcasts in general, who are all inspired by people like people like uh, Joe Rogan, people like um, fucking Theo Vaughn, um, Dave Chappelle, whoever people who do podcasts in general. Um, that's a good thing. <laughs> these are all people who are successful yeah. at doing something right to be inspired by these people is, is a good thing yeah so for I, I say this to say for other people who want to do things um whether that's gym fitness or uh fitness igs be youtubers producers real estate whatever you whatever your interest is yeah. right that's it's good to be inspired don't let people shit on you just because and i feel like most of the time people who shit on other people is because um they're jealous they're just it's usually envy uh, it's usually that they know that they can't do that, so they're gonna shit on you, and you. And so, a lot of time, it's because you're doing something, or they, f like you're doing something better than them, you know. Like that's what because I, I've never felt like no, uh, for, uh, some huge podcast. Let's say like Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan's never gonna speak on us. He's not gonna say, "Oh, those dudes are losers." That's not you know who's always saying that. Oh, these dudes are this and that. The losers. It's motherfuckers that aren't doing nothing. The losers. <laughs> The ones that are under you. Yeah. In fact, it's never the one, it's not and, the people doing better. It's in, oh, fact, yeah. in fact, you know what it is, bro? Is you're right. The people that are below you, they will want you to drag you to their With level. Them. Yep. But the people that are successful, mm. they want to drag you up. They want to bring you. They want to drag you up. Well, if yo, Joe Rogan hears about us and he's like, fuck, this podcast, like they're doing well. Yeah. They're young. They're aspired to be funny. Me. Yeah. I want to help them. Yeah, like that. That's usually what people. What that's usually what successful. Yeah, people do. And to speak on that, like shout out to the podcast. So like compliment us. Like yeah, no, no. Shout, shout out to all the like, pods that that reached out who want to do collabs yeah, that want to work friends. with us that want to just fucking that or that just not they just like us that follow yeah. us that say our shit's funny. Um, other, I've, I've I have a bunch of people reaching out to start podcasts because they need me, my help for whatever it is. See, even that's or, the thing too. Or like, or or, or they'll they'll reach out just saying um like. Your shit's funny. Simple yeah. as that. To me, that's appreciated because no one has to say anything. Yeah, they don't have to. Go ahead. My bad. No, you, said, <laughs> you said, see, that's the thing. But see, that's the thing. I don't remember. Fuck. <laughs> Every time. I got to stop interrupting you. My fault. It's just I lose my train of thought. Yeah. It's like that's my fault. That's erase my fault. this. Um, but yeah, um, it's again, it's always people who, and I hate to use the thing under because I, I don't, I think we're all equal. You know, I don't think people are under me. We're just um, doing something different. But let's just let's just say people who are pretty much doing nothing look at us or look at people and go, well, fuck them. People who are doing something never look down and go, oh, fuck them. Mm -hmm. It's usually, it's always complimentary. It's always like, oh, keep doing your shit. Keep doing, you know what I mean? Yeah, so, like, going, like, and those people like, like my homegirl Kim Kardashian said, like, People don't want to work these days. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll, we'll get into that a little later. We'll get into that. But yeah, I mean, motherfuckers just can't do shit for themselves. So they got to shit on other people for doing what they want to do. 
Um, and again, it's just they can, bro. And, and not to mention, that's true. And this is to touch back on the thing that you were talking about earlier, uh, the, the three month thing. Why is it three months? Why is it a year, right? Why, what, why are you doing all these times? I hit the, okay. The timeline thing, right? Life is a fucking risk. Take a fucking risk. Yeah. Take a, stop putting all these stupid timelines. Oh, I'm not going to kiss for three months. Oh no, you can't have sex to work. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Take a fucking risk. Live your life. What kind of, if you're reading a fucking book that tells you that you shouldn't fucking kiss for three months because men are shitty, bro, there's something wrong with you. Not you know men. what you sound like? You sound like a robot. Y- you, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like you have these set guidelines and rules yeah. of how to do this. Not to mention relationships and, and, and shit like that. There's no, it's not a guide. It's just like a video game, bro. You got to unlock this. <laughs> got to go through this many missions. Just take, I've been saying, take a risk. Mm-hmm. Be hurt. Be heartbroken. Be cheated. We're not do, saying be a hoe and shit, but. And if you want to be a hoe, like, be a hoe. Just do. Be yeah. a hoe. Yeah. Fuck it. Do whatever but, you're comfortable with. You know, yeah. my oh. thing, what I'm seeing more and more is that people are so afraid to be her or take a risk in a relationship or, oh, I don't want to be with him because what if he this? That's life. You live and Yo, learn. Yo, we're all, thank you. You, you live, live and learn. learn. All of us have been hurt. I've been hurt. See, but at the same you've time, been hurt. If, you've been hurt. Yeah, all but if, if you don't. We, we've all been played. Yeah. yeah but this shit happens. You don't see me fucking laying down and crying. Time for another girl. Or time for what? <laughs> not even that, but time to just keep living. It makes you a better person, bro. You keep, you live and learn. You live and learn. Keep doing your shit. Take a fucking risk. Not to mention, everything in life is a risk. So, the, everything that you learn, and, and I've heard this from people that travel, right? People okay. that travel, that's the best, like, education that you could ever get. Okay. And it's not necessarily the traveling aspect. It's yeah. just the life experiences. Yeah, yeah. The life experience is the best education you can ever get in your life. That, the, the, why, why do you think jobs want you to have two years experience? Bro, it's, exact, <laughs> it's exactly <laughs> not, what I'm talking about. Not to about. mention, when you get a fucking job... um. You usually learn what you're actually going to do on the job. You don't already know usually. Correct. No, you don't. There are jobs. Yes, I know. You go into them and you should know what you're doing. But yeah. most of them, you're just going to learn while you're there. Yeah. And that's good. That's fine. That's what fair. they want to know is if you're uh, uh, capable to learn. Yeah. If you have the uh, uh, the ability to learn and and to and to do what you have to do. If you're, if you're smart enough and if you can follow rules, are you responsible? They don't give a fuck if you already know how to fucking come on, dog. What are we doing? You know what I mean? Yeah, unless so, you're like a doctor. Yeah, again, if you're and, a doctor and you need that sort of expertise, and even, I get it. And even but that, if it's an entry level job, and I'm just talking in general, yeah, right. You're like you said, any entry level job, anyone, literally anyone can go in and do that. Not job. even entry, a CEO. You think there's a people are, are out there? There's set guidelines for CEOs. Yeah. You think someone studies to be a CEO? No, no you one. just end up being that, and then you learn to be a CEO from a mentor or why you're doing it. Yeah. No. Put it like this. You think Elon Musk was learning, was being taught how to be a CEO? No. Motherfucker just figured that shit out. Yeah. It's that simple. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You need to have some background and think like if you're a something in finance. Yeah. You have to know a little bit. You have to have some, bro. I know for sure. Okay. From, I know personally, financial advisors that say I go in, I went into the job knowing nothing. These are the people that handle millions of dollars. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You see what I'm saying? Yeah. So you learn this shit on, on the on, on the job and you learn shit as you go. You don't you aren't just prepared. This is the thing. And again, just take a risk. Take a risk. Don't don't live your life so binary, so things are so, so tunnel fluid. Visioned. Yeah. So tunnel visioned. Things and are that's fluid. the problem, bro. People aren't open minded. They're not. They're not open minded. That's why uh, uh, experience. Experiences in general. It's good to have experiences. People look at, oh, you slept with so many girls, or you did this, or or you whatever. But I, I've had experiences. I saw like, yeah, okay. There are differences in between like being a hoe and having experience or doing or having fun. And, and you know what I mean? Like um, people think, be, oh, for example, uh, a little bro. chili back there? Yeah. yeah I'm gonna put, this was, okay. I got to pee. That's why, bro. For example, back in the day, doing drugs of any kind was like, oh, that's taboo. Like, what the fuck? You're, you're, that, you're a certain type of person. Now, doing drugs is an experience. Mm-hmm. People do drugs to go to a rave, and it's such same a norm. shit, and it's a norm. Same, exactly. It's such a norm, bro. And it's just, it, it's yeah. like nothing. It's like nothing. People, like, come on. Oh, you got the Molly? Oh, you got the E for yeah. the experience. Don't coke in a bathroom. Mm. <laughs> it's yeah. good to yo. It's good to live. It's yeah. good to take a risk. You know. Yes, there are certain 
Uh, you know the lions. Yeah, because yeah, in, yeah, in the bar, just like the, anything in life. Yeah, in the bar, in the bathroom. If you see, yeah, motherfuckers, just... two guys go in the stall. Oh, that means, that means one of two things. Yeah, you know? I'm not gonna say what those two things are, but mm. we could all use our imagination. Yeah. One of two things for sure. Yeah, yeah. Things. I'm down. And Hector for both. goes for both. <laughs> you know, <laughs> Hector's in there for both of them. He's just, <laughs> he's ready to go. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> he wasn't ready for that one. Huh? You, I got you on that one. Um, sorry, I got myself all the time. You know? I just be out here. You're milking others, <laughs> milking shit. Um, <laughs> he was milking a bull. But to quickly go back to the online bullying thing, um, just a last low. Um, again, I thought. It was not cool to online bully. I thought we were all against it. I thought it was terrible. It's not. Um, but until, it, and it's you know when it's cool? When it's something you're not fucking with. Oh, now yeah. it's time to online bully. This motherfucker kill himself. I don't give a fuck. Yeah. Very selective. It's just people are so fake. Yeah, I think, yes. So fake, yes. Bro. So fucking fake. So fucking fake. The same way they want to act like they're angels and they've never done anything. And uh, no, I would never do that. I would never hurt somebody. I've never played anyone. They're yeah, you so have. We all have. Flop. Like, yeah, same thing. Again, I've said, uh, come on, dog. We're all bad, but some people are worse than others. And yeah, like, there are extremes. Cool. There are extremes at each end. Yeah. And I um, get like, there. I know, like, we all know, like, a few people that are just, like, really kind people that don't really, like, get into, like, yeah. no, there are people no like, like, extra shit. Yeah. But there's not a lot of them either. Nah, right? For the majority, I, would, I think the majority is us. Yeah. And the dudes, have, dudes that are. Do a lot of good. Hold on, hold on. My boy Wesley out here, damn. Yeah, this dick procedure. Damn, look at this. That's just going from a three inch to the nine, huh? Yeah, damn. Is that a little yeah. last of that? Shit. Damn, okay. Wesley. That's it. Damn. Oh, damn. <laughs> okay, my boy. Hey, I'm glad you took the pot off. Okay. <laughs> day, day, day off? Day off. Hey, we all deserve a day off. That's good. Yeah. I like that. Um <laughs> Damn, Hector. I, st I stopped you again, huh? No, I didn't. No? I was um, going to use the restroom, bro. In three, two, penis. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. After a quick uh, bathroom break, we are back. Bathroom. Quick commercial break. Quick circle jerk. Circle <laughs> jerk. Circle. The gang is back. Um, circle jerk on a cookie. Last <laughs> one to bust eats it. Isn't that a, a thing? Wookie cookie or something like that? Isn't it, I thought that was a, a hazing thing. Yeah. Not like for... I'm glad I wasn't in no uh, fraternity. <laughs> in <a> fra <laughs> yeah, I thought that was. Maybe I, I could be wrong. I don't know. It sounds like they do that shit for fun. <laughs> <laughs> nah, fuck that. What the fuck? Okay. Yeah. Um, I mean, I might be down, but... <laughs> <laughs> George is down. Okay, so going on dates for free food. Okay, so this is one thing... We're going to keep going back to... Okay, so people were saying some wild shit about about me, right? In the comments, right? Um, so talking about coercion. Co blah, blah, blah. This is some wild shit, right? That made yeah. no, had nothing to do with the fucking video, but whatever. For people like me, uh, what does coercion mean? Um, So you're essentially tricking. You're tricking someone. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Right, okay. Like you're, you're manipulating them. You're tricking them into doing something. Okay, okay, okay. So, okay. I like that word. Thank you. Good one, huh? Yeah. So I thought it was weird for them to be saying that men coerce women into doing this and that and blah 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 right whatever um and again going just talking about how men are the worst right um what about women that go on dates just for free food what about that should i sue for coercion for for being led astray yeah i think you <laughs> right should, bro yeah I'll what about right. that girls go on dates just for free food all the time i I've, know that personally i've heard it I've, I I know girls personally have told me that. Oh, yeah, I've, I go on dates sometimes just for free food. That's simple. Mm -hmm. Shit happens. What? Oh, should they be blocked up? <laughs> are, are they? Are they? Uh, yeah, bro. Fuck. That. Have you guys? Do you guys think that you guys have ever been yes. in situations like this? Yeah. Yeah. Hundred percent. Yeah. yeah. I think I think so yeah. too. But just Not indirectly, I don't, I probably didn't know. Oh, but, I didn't know either. <laughs> but now that I, I think about it, like I think back. I, I think that might have happened to me a few times. A few times. Yeah, not too many. I, I would say like two, three times. I think that definitely has happened to me where I was like, damn. I think we just went out for food. I yeah. think that's all she wanted. Yeah, just paid for your whole. Yeah. And which, by the way, cool. I eat that. It's good. Like, yeah. I, I eat, it's not even an L. Like, fuck it. What? I just paid for food. Like, yeah, yeah. not the end of the world, right? It wasn't like a $3,000 meal or nothing. Yeah, we just. See, fucking... but that's the thing. Going back to the point about like, like when girls only like 
say like, oh, all men want is sex. Yeah. Like, what about the experience like we had like during the day? Like, like you know how like someone would try to say like, oh, you, you take you out on a nice date and then you expect sex. It's mm-hmm. not that we expect sex. It's yeah. just like, like that shit would be nice. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not, not, not like, cherry on top. <laughs> yeah. Like, I, we're having a good time, right? Yeah. Like, I think I'm pretty sure like, yeah. that's why I assume like you want to like go on this date with me. You right. Know? And, and, and we know, find each like, other attractive. Yeah, and like I'm having a good time. Yeah, and like why? Why does why not? Like, going Things get a little point. spicy. Yeah. yeah, like and again, and if you don't want to, that's fine. Yeah, we're consent boys. Like oh yeah, we haven't said that in a while. Consent boys. Yeah, consent. consent boys all the time. Like if you don't like, none of us here is gonna expect sex. Like Ever. from from a sometimes, date. Sometimes I'm surprised at sex. <laughs> like, yeah, you want to oh, yeah. fuck right now? Oh, yeah, oh shit. Down? It's no not, way! It's not even nighttime yet. Yeah, <laughs> like I was not expecting this. Let me like, just give a disclaimer: I'm down all the time. <laughs> yeah, uh, I'm not gonna do that. I'm not. I'm not down all the time. Not for all of y'all. Sometimes I'd be regretting shit. Oh, um, shit. regretting? Uh, you don't regretting? You, that means that means after the fact. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, you learn from the regret that you know maybe I shouldn't all the time. I don't know, you got a few catfishes. Mm. I feel like that's the only no. way you regret. Nah, because no, catfish, no, no, catfish no. is only if you haven't met them, right? Uh, nah, a catfish is someone who who shows up and doesn't look like how you thought they were gonna look. You still not smashing? No. That but I don't. I don't think that's ever happened to me. Yeah, yeah I don't it's think it's happened. Yeah, to that's me that's, that's I, just, you know, I don't think that's ever happened to me. I feel like you could tell like a person looks like a certain. Woman. Oh, you know what? That might have happened to me once. What happened? Speak about it. It's just so, you know, <laughs> it's not my type. You know, let's just say that. What happened? You thought you it was your type? Still, but it was, did you still pay for her dinner? Oh, we still had a nice time. Yeah. Still had a nice time. Everything was cool. I mean, we still, you know, it was just, it's not my type. You know? Gave her a makeout kill? No. Uh, no, 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 it was just, we just had fun. I just made sure we both had fun and whatever. And we just yeah. went in separate ways. Uh, she just wasn't my type. You know, she's, yeah. like, uh, you know, <laughs> oh, damn. She was flexible? Nah, she was just, you know. I don't know what you're saying, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I don't, but I do. Um, but yeah, like shit happens, and I think that's one. And it's not like I had a feeling. And kudos to you, you didn't disrespect her, right? No, nah. nah again, she, good time. she you was still, just You could have just left. She was still really pretty, and she was still really cool. Um, and it's not. It's not like she was huge or nothing. It just wasn't my hey, type. Don't say that. Just wasn't my type. That's all. Yeah, just say that. <laughs> <laughs> say that part. <laughs> it just wasn't it was my not, type. That's all. <laughs> like, this, and there's nothing. Fuck it, like. Dog, okay, so this is okay, hey, this, but this, no, 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 no. Stop, point, stop, stop, stop. This is what I don't fucking get. If I if if I don't have a thing for, for big girls, right? And I say that shit, oh, it's fucking that. Oh, you can't say that, dude. See, but you like no. what you like. Don't interrupt me right now. Dude. I've got a good fucking point. Please. One second, okay? If I don't like big girls, that's just not my thing, right? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Look, I got acted like damn. You like the cushion, oh, cushion the pushing. Hey, hey, don't even want to talk no more, huh? He's done. <laughs> okay. So like, As there's a, disrespect. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's just I was about to make. I was really about to go off. Okay, go ahead, bro. So if if I, if my thing is I'm just not into big girls, right? If that's just my thing, and yeah. I say that, then I'm the fucked up one, right? But if a girl says that she's not into me because I'm short, bro, I said that's this cool, shit. right? I said this shit in the. Like, I know you did, bullshit, and that's why we're saying it again because that's why I don't fucking get. I can't. I can't even come on here and say that because I'm gonna be. I'm. I look like the asshole because I don't like bigger girls. And by the way, there's nothing wrong with bigger girls. That's not my thing. Right, there are other, and there's nothing wrong with you like not liking them. Either. Exactly, that's my thing. Yo, okay, I know dudes personally who like big girls who literally tell me, "Yo, I'm, that's my thing." Good for them, like that's dope. Because yeah. the big girls are beautiful too. It's just not my. That's not what I'm mostly attracted to. That's not my thing, right? But if I say that I'm the asshole, but if a girl tells me she doesn't fuck with me because I'm short, the girls that say that in general, like, oh, like you got to be five eight and above. No one like, says nothing, right? It's, it's all good because you're short. It doesn't fucking matter. Fuck this kid. Yeah, that's fucked up. Where, so where's the double standards are funny, aren't they? Bro, I've lived this double my whole standards life, are bro. funny. Sometimes I even bro, they can I, you say know, that with free reign. But you know what's funny about that whole thing is that you don't even have to say. It. I already know. You oh, know what I mean? What, um, like they indirectly tell you that. Shit. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, but see again, and not only that, they can ask without making it sound like it's a big deal. Oh, just how tall? Oh, are you? how tall are you? Yeah. Oh, five. Whatever. Uh, oh. Oh damn! Oh. How, how much do you weigh? Yeah. Oh, oh. don't ask that question. You don't say that, motherfucker. Don't ask You're that. about to get fucking exposed yeah. and blah blah blah. Yeah. Yo, again, exactly. we all have preferences. What is wrong with that? It's one thing if I say fuck fat girls. You're fucking ugly. That's mm-hmm. fucked up. I don't do that. I don't yeah. say that. I don't say that to you guys either. 
Not in private, not in, never. Mm-hmm. But if I just say, yo, that's not my thing. That's not what I'm into. That's not what I'm mostly attracted to. Oh, good. That's just what it is. Yeah. If a girl just says, yo, I'm not, I don't like dating shorter guys. Cool. Fair enough. That's I don't not take that. It's all I about never, being respectful for sure. I've never taken that offensively. Mm-hmm. I understand, matter of fact. <laughs> I get it. You're five, you're six foot. <laughs> I'm five six and five. And you seven. know, there's girls that are tall that like shorter guys too. I've dated them. I've been with girls who are taller than me, yeah. and I'm like, for real? I'll like, okay. If you <laughs> if you don't mind, then I don't. Yeah. Because I'm with it, you know. Um. Yeah. So again, it shouldn't. Like, the double standards are, are wild because a girl can say that with free reign, with no fucking. Not to mention, they could do it in direct that like you said. Mm-hmm. Oh, how tall are you? Oh, oh damn. Mm, oh like man, sad. or just sad face. You're cute. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, damn. Well, that's you know. <laughs> But you can um, imagine um, how fucked up would that be, or how fucked up would that be taken if you went around to all the girls that you were talking to? You know, like, oh, how much do you weigh? They'd be like, "Excuse me, what the fuck that's did you just ask me?" Business, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, you no, no girl. I, I don't, I don't even care if they're thin or skin, whatever you want to say. They are not going to tell. You that, what the fuck is wrong with you? Mm-hmm. What is the equality? What is you know? Double, yeah. yo, come on, come no, on. I mean, I came to pod today. This, I came to pod today. I'm telling you that. And we're only saying this is like, it happens on both sides. Like, it does. There's shitty That's people the on both sides, and yep. we're not trying to like only women, only women, only women. Like, we're just we're saying we're speaking generalities because well, it applies to both sides. Yeah, we've said always. that it's it's both men and, and that, women. That's our whole point in this whole women. like right. fucking whatever and, the fuck we've been saying. And because I mean, I'm sure we've or whatever all heard. Marlo's been saying. He's the only one talking. <laughs> well, I'm sure we've all heard <laughs> both it in passing, or people in, like in, in groups where they say, "Oh no, nah, I don't fuck with so and so," you know, or like they this so and so is they, they're ugly. And I'm like, damn, bro. And not only that, bro, it's it's ethnicities too. Oh, I don't like, I only like white guys. I only yeah. like black guys. I only like Mexicans. Like, it's everything, bro. It's I, I find generalities. it funny too. Generalities. Like, it's I, people I find have, it fu- and people bro. have their types. That's cool. But yeah. don't act like you're. Just don't disrespect the other people. Yeah. Don't act like we're, there's not good people on the other side. Yeah. And I, it's, it's crazy because I'll see. Um, so, it's, for example, if. Um, if a dude says, oh, um, I'm mostly into uh, Latina women or I'm mostly into Asian girls, or, I'm mostly into black, don't fetishize me. Don't this and that. But you've, then, got, you've gotten that before? Uh, no, I haven't. No? Because for one, I mean, yeah, I, I, you guys all know. Oh, yeah. We, but, we, we know you like your pho. Yeah, but I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm not weird about it, though. No. There are fucking weirdos out there. I get that. But then you'll see girls say, oh, I'm, oh I love Mexican men. I love this. And I'm like... That's weird. No, no. I think no. That, that is weird, though. I, you think so? I think that's weird. Okay. Why? Because tell me. Nah. Because like I think it's just I, I think though. I have. I mean, I, I, don't, I don't have a type, right. but those who do, yeah. Like just being vocal about it. That's yeah. kind of weird. No. Uh, not again. I I just think it's preferences. Because like, like imagine you going yeah. to a club, right? Or just going to. Like a, a hangout setting. Yeah, like a party. And you're just like, mm. nah, like, I love Asian women. <laughs> yeah. I just absolutely love I Asian you, women. I, you. I you don't talk. fuck with nobody else? No one else. Oh, okay, that's weird. I think that's fucking No, no, weird. that is weird. Okay, I thought I thought you just meant um, just... I don't uh, think that's weird. I feel like that's just an extreme situation. <laughs> no, no, I, I I agree with him. That's weird. That's if weird. If you only bro. like... Because, again, you guys know, but that doesn't mean that's it. Like, I... Yeah, fucking like Mexican, Italian, you fucking oh, oh, oh. Indian, you name it. Yeah, oh, I'm all around the world, baby. You know, <laughs> I mean, he's Mr. Worldwide. I'm Mr. Worldwide, you know. <laughs> but like, um, it's but that, I think that's weird for sure. If yeah. I, if someone if like you, if, 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 if say we go to a party or yeah. some shit, and like the first Asian girl walks in, and Marlo's like, Why there she is, there she is. That's it. <laughs> There's the one. That's who I've been waiting for. Yeah, nah, that's yeah. That's weird, bro. I get you. I get you. Yeah. If you're just one, damn, that's that's a little off. Yeah. That's yeah, I I get that. But I I, okay. But that's why I thought it was funny that if a guy says Mm -hmm. or when a guy says, Oh, I'm into this, like a race, that it's whoa, don't no, you can't. What I but then a girl says, I'm only into or I'm I love Mexican, I love black men, I love white men. It's all good. Mm-hmm. No one says they're fetishizing anybody. Yeah, right? it's it. Sometimes, it, sometimes it seems like like we can do no right, right? Yeah, like anything we say is being taken 
up the abs. Negatively up the ass. You're taking a person no where, where we mean something three dim- like we're playing 3D chess and shit. Nah, bro, I'm just saying shit. Now, <laughs> is that does that have to do with like how being sensitive, yes. And emotional? Somewhat. Because yeah, like I, think so. I mean yeah. I mean there's emotional men. There's more and there's emotional Oh, there's I'm emotional not. women, we, we, we've seen but there's emotional also men. emotional men. Yeah, well, all the time. And yeah. we've also, I mean, I mean, uh, I'm, I don't know about you guys, but I've yeah. heard it more so that more women are emotional. Again, this is just what I've heard. Yeah, yeah. Right. Okay. I'm not saying this. I've heard this. Yeah. Right. So do you think it caters to that specific situation? To, to we, women we who can't are emotional? Uh, we can't say these specific things because women are more emotional. I wouldn't say, I think, uh, I would say more so like Hector says, sensitive. Sensitive, emotional. I think sensitive, just like, and to to your point earlier, where you said um, it's because they it's happened to them. That's why mm-hmm. they're so they're taking it so personally. Yeah, you know what I mean? Because like they saw that TikTok about the fake boyfriend, they're like, damn, that shit happened to me, or I know it hits oh, a nerve. On. Yo, this is I'm so glad I thought about this. Oh my god, this is the funniest shit ever. There were multiple. I want to say maybe ten to fifteen people saying sometimes they do it for three years. Or my ex did that for three years. Hmm. Three years? Baby. Ain't nobody fake for three years. <laughs> Baby. Come on. Like, you just got played or, or yeah. shit just didn't work out. Yeah. Why is it that? Three years? Hector, are you putting up a front for three years? Nah, fuck those. Bro, I can't Get even put up a front for a, a week. Yeah. Let alone a three years? Yeah, I feel bad. Come I on. can't do that shit. Dog. I've tried on. it, but then I'm like, nah, you can't do this to somebody. <laughs> three years, Three. Dog. There were people actually saying... My ex did that for three. No, no, no. Your ex and you just didn't work out. He wasn't faking it. He wasn't and, fronting. And, and that's fucked up, bro. And a lot of times in those situations, like those people have all the all the freedom in the world to leave, but they choose mm-hmm. to say. Oh, and then I love the I love the no, but you don't understand. It's hard to leave. No. It bro. is. It, it is, is hard. It, I don't but it's not unless it is, but unless, it's not impossible. Yeah. Bro. I Unless, feel like at some point you have to realize like, okay, this is not a good situation for me. Yes. I'm out. Unless you're being it's held okay host- to tolerate somebody and right. then like be like, okay, like I'm a, I'm gonna try to work something with this person. Yeah, yeah. Like I'm, a, I'm, a, I hopefully they grow yeah. to the point where like we're we're satisfied where right, we're right, at okay. with but, each other. But if there's it's the same bullshit for however long yeah. for three plus years, yeah, nah, like that's you, bro. that's you, that's yes. you. Go ahead. If, it's, you if it's more, bro. If you're dealing with that bullshit for three years, I think that's I think that's your, that's I think you. That's your fault. Balance. Yeah, come on. And not only that, the only the only way you can't leave is if you're being held hostage. And at that yeah. point, <laughs> and that's bro, a different issue. Yeah, that's 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 some, that's, 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 that's police. Like, yeah, that's police that's like a different involved. situation. Yeah, that's. But I completely agree. Nah, bro. Three years. If you are dealing with the same bullshit for three years, and we're not talking once or twice. No, we're talking on. like a lot. Yeah. Mm-hmm. If you're dealing with that bullshit that's for true. three years, you you got to balance. You have an option to leave, like all leave the time. all the time. Don't say option. that it's hard. It's hard, yeah. yeah. Nothing, nothing in life is fucking easy. Exactly. But if you're hurting for three years, it's possible you're gonna continue to hurt, bro. It's the same shit that I've been talking about with Go like ahead. the Mexican national team, and I know, like, okay. and I always like to refer all my no, situations no, no. with do sports, it, it. bro. Right, Mexican national team right now they fucking suck, mm-hmm. right. Are you going to continue the same? Bless Sorry, you. Are you going to continue the same system, knowing the same results? Right, right. For the for That's the crazy. next year and a half or mm-hmm. whatever, or would you rather start something new mm-hmm. with the chance of something new happening? Right, right. Develop something else, something different. Yeah, right. Mm-hmm. And it's the same thing with relationships. Right, you're going to deal with the same person mm-hmm. all the time, knowing mm-hmm. that it's not just it's going to be the same bullshit. Yeah, I'm going to be upset. I'm going to be sad. I'm going to be heartbroken. Yep. But I'm still going to give this person the time of day because I. Love this person. I understand. I agree. I agree. That's I. I don't understand, bro. Me either. That and again, that's. And you, you guys are right. It is hard to leave. I understand that it's hard, but to say that just because it's hard, oh, now I can't leave. Like, nah, you can. You can go. We've, <laughs> we've all been in the situation. We've all been in relationship relationships where you, damn, it's just yeah, you don't want to leave. It's hard. You you love this person, but yo, you just got to. Yeah. You got to man up or woman up. And fucking leave. You can't be doing this all the time. Yeah. At some point, you got to fucking man up. Mm-hmm. At some point, you got to woman up and say, enough is enough. I understand if she's going, if, it, if it's happening, let's say, like you said, once or twice. Shit happened. Okay. Shit, things happen. Yeah. But if you're dealing with the same bullshit from month one to year four, 
baby, that's that's you. That's you. You're part of the problem. You're you're the issue. You're part of the issue. Yeah. Don't put it on the other. Like, oh no, he was. It was only him. Yeah. Like he treated me so. Oh, bad. so you just you just stayed there. Yeah. You were just fucking. Oh, so you just walked in like an angel and you yeah. didn't do anything. Nah, absolutely not. You, Come on. You did something. There's, yeah. It's not, not only that, you might have not did anything. You might have. You didn't do anything. You probably, played a part, but you like, you yeah. stuck around. You stuck around. You stuck you around. Have a choice. Yeah. You have a fucking choice to go. Yeah. You have a choice to go, and that's again, that's not just for that's for men and women. And I've been there. So have I. I've been there. Like, that's why I, I, I've been in a situation where it was toxic. Like, yeah. fuck. And it is hard to leave. But once you leave, like, it's the but best feeling ever, right? bro. Like, you're out. Like, you're you're in the streets. Like, you, not you to, meet different people. Not it, to it mention, I was in, in the time I was aware of what I was doing. I was aware that this is toxic. I was aware that um, I should probably get out. Yeah. And I was choosing to stay in hopes of something changing. Yeah. And when I finally couldn't take, a, take, a, take more, I said... Now I'm out. Yeah. But I was fully, it's not like I was, oh no, like things are so you're, great. You had a persona. Yeah. Like, like you're playing a character. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And they want to, they want to, they, they say that like to your point, I think you said that, no, like they, they want to say that because things didn't end one. Well. Yeah, they, exactly. They just, they say, oh, the dude was uh, faking the whole time or he was putting up this front. Oh, they say like, oh, you didn't really love me. But yeah. You didn't. Re- no, no. It just didn't work out. And that's okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I've said something here. For the most part, the relationships we are in are not going to work out. For the most it is just part. that simple. It's just odds. Like when you at, when high school sweethearts or you have your first girlfriend or your your fifth, like the odds are it's probably not going to work out. Yeah. And the only time it works out, especially then, early the time on, it works out. And it works out. And that's your girl. That's, and that's, that's your exactly. wife. That's especially that's early on. Person. Yeah, especially early on. Like you, again, that's why it's good to experience. That's why it's good to date you know, and go yeah, out. Yeah, it's good and to like do these Put things. yourself out there and all that stuff. And, and when yeah, things don't bro. work out, they just don't work out. And yeah. there are reasons for that. But it's not. And I feel like you. Let's you, not be. Let's be real about the reasons, though. And not but, only. And just because this one guy gave you a hard time. Right. Not all men are like that. Exactly. And not all women are like that. No, they're not. And again, no, no one wants to take accountability for the and, shit they do. And going back to what we said. Yeah. We've been in these situations where it hasn't worked out and we've been played and we've been stuck in these situations. Yep. But that hasn't stopped us. Nope. From going out and putting ourselves out there. Nope. I've been in, I mean, you guys have made fun of me for being in a lot of relationships, yeah. right? But I put myself out there because yeah. I, I'm i hopeful yeah, yeah. that I, something I good it. will happen, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I mean, bro, just because one girl has been bad yeah. doesn't mean that everyone's bad like that's, that. That's my thing. Um, we, again, like you said, we've all been through shitty situations. Yeah. And you don't hear me coming in like, damn, bro. She's only going to play you, dog. She's only going to play you, dog. Yeah, like if you come in, bro, and and you're telling me, oh, like I got this girl. Yeah. Like I like her. She's cool. And yeah. I've been in a situation where like uh, like she fu- they, they played, like I got, I got played, whatever. And I go up to you mm. and I'm like, nah, bro, you're going to get played. Don't even do it. Oh, it's not. Like how toxic do I sound telling oh, you that, bro? Bro, I'm like, yo, what's- But you know what, bro? I've seen situations where women do that. I've I've actually had people um do that to me. Yeah. No, no, like guys. Oh really? Yeah, and it wasn't even that I um, told them. Mm-hmm. It was just like they 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 heard. Like let's just say we're in close proximity, or so and so said something, or they just saw, and then they come up. And it's it's never obviously not you guys, yeah, but yeah. just acquaintances or people who know you, right? And they're like, oh, you'll be this, and I'm like, or like, nah, bro, don't even don't even waste your time. Like girls are them like, but you're That's fucking, a hater. you're weird, bro. Yeah. Like. You, like, you like girls, I, right? I, you I like have, girls or no? Yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> bro, I like girls, so I'm gonna keep dating girls. Yeah. I don't care if the last one fucking ripped my heart out. I'm gonna mm-hmm. keep dating girls. Yeah. Like it's that simple. That's why I think it's weird that girls date guys and then shit on them and then give other girls advice about how how shitty they are. No, don't this just wait. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, bro. bro. It's just like what? It's weird. I don't. I'm almost. Um, Speechless. Yeah, I, I can't even find the word sometimes because it makes no rational. It's not rational to me. It's also it's also the whole oh like she was a hoe. Well, she yeah. was a hoe when she was single. Yeah, let her be a hoe. That's my. Let idea. him be a hoe. Yeah, <laughs> Thank let you. them be a hoe. <laughs> let them. I, like, but that doesn't mean that they're gonna be a hoe when when they're with you. When they're with you. Yeah, I, I, that's why um, tra- your track record. Mm-hmm. Um, if 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 your track record is that you cheat on everybody and that's the thing that goes around and people know that then that, that makes sense. But if some girl who, let's say, um, is quote unquote a hoe or like gets her, or like she's out and part, whatever. Um, if I don't know that she's actual, actually a hoe, 
Damn, I'm not gonna just because she goes out and because yeah. she I don't and not just and not because this guy tell, comes up to me he's like oh like she's a hoe I'm not gonna I mean cool dog, thank I've, you thank you for the information but that yo, doesn't mean that I, I'm gonna fucking listen I to have you, dog. never listened to that yeah and by the way I would come on dog I, if I saw Hector with this like so and so I'm like hey bro, she's a hoe don't even nah, that's some hater shit that is in hater. my opinion yeah that's some hater shit I'd like, be like bro good for you and not not even that but how. Unless you're right, don't even mention anything, bro. Yeah, don't even say anything. <laughs> Yo, what? <laughs> why am I saying that to this dude? You're right. Think about why someone will say that to you. Usually, hate, envy, because all envy. this dude's getting bitches. Anytime my boy or anybody tells like, but if it's my boy, it's like, oh hell yeah, like, that's, yeah, yeah, that's what's up. I don't go, <laughs> oh shit, she fucks with you. Oh, she must be a hoe. That's some <laughs> fucking hater shit. Is it not? Yeah, yeah, bro. If I, to if make I that assumption, that, if I heard that, I'd be like, "Oh, for real? Hell yeah!" No. Yeah, but honestly, though, like, if oh, I was single, yeah, <laughs> make that little little, yeah, little asterisk. Um, <laughs> but yeah, damn. But that is crazy. I don't. Yeah. Um, so watch it though. Well, I mean, it's a while. I mean, honestly, bro, the streets are hot right now. Yeah. What do you guys streets think? It's, I mean, uh, the, it's uh, spring's coming up, spring's you know, coming. or we're in spring already, actually. Yeah, I think so, right? We're in spring. It just came out. Yeah, it's getting a little hot. It's getting I a little mean, cold. Wesley's out there. Wesley's Doing getting thing. getting yeah. getting replenished. Yeah, getting, my boy is getting a little polishing. Oh yeah, he's. I'll tell you what, he's gonna come in next week and have some some good stories, have some things to say. I think. Yeah, Yo, I so, hope so. Yeah, I hope so. He's, I'm after say, a week off, nah, he's you know he's gonna be coming re- recharged and shit. Yeah, so I'm excited for him to come in. Um, <laughs> But the streets are hot. Shit's getting hot. Um, Kobe Covington, Masvidal. Let's get into that real quick. Oh, um, five minutes. Okay. Yeah. So both UFC fighters, they both just had a fight actually in the cage. Two weeks ago, yeah. Yeah, literally two, three weeks ago. Um, Masvidal kind of got his ass beat. Um, Kobe definitely won the fight. He definitely dominated. Masvidal had his moments. Um, I was rooting for him. Um, he lost. Kobe was saying some wild shit about this dude's family and about his wife or ex-wife or whatever you want to call it. Okay. Um, and just honestly saying some wild shit. And now it seems to allegedly be the case that Masvidal duffed this dude in front of a in front of a restaurant where he was with the Nug Boys actually. Um, Masvidal, uh, Kobe was. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's Kobe right. Covington yeah, was yeah, with yeah. the yeah, Nelk boys, right. and he came out of the restaurant, and Masvidal ran up on him. You know, Nelk. the Nelk boys gave him a a belt. Who? King of Miami gave who a belt? Covington. No, he, he I didn't. swear they took a flick with him. Oh shit, that's wild. Okay, yeah, because you know how uh, Masvidal has the BMF title. Yeah. How Kobe had the, the, King the King of Miami. That's crazy. I'm pretty sure that's why he was talking shit to him. Right. Okay. That's crazy. I didn't know that. That's cool. That's wild. Um, so yeah. So he ran up on him, you know, gave him a little two, three piece, four piece, ran off, apparently. Um, and now Kobe Covington is pressing charges. And some people are saying, like, at, he should. He's a they're they're UFC fighters, they already had a fight, mm-hmm. this and that. Or Kobe's a bitch. For this is a bitch move. Chime in, guys. Somebody. Um, Give me what you I, guys think. I never Hector? I never see shit like that, bro. Like, I, I don't know. It's because I, I just don't care. Like, if he press charges or not, like, that's him. Like, if you want to do that, then do that shit. But if not, like, I don't know. that. I think I two, wish I could have an opinion on that. Yeah. I just feel, like, okay. indifferent about yeah, okay. it. Okay. I, 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 these are the two best points that I've seen. It's just, like, I, the shit don't, don't bother me. Like, if you want to be that type of person, like... Then be well, that it doesn't have to bother this. you. Yes. It, huh? doesn't have to, it doesn't have to bother you. It's just, you know, what do you think? That's all. Mm, Are you saying you don't really think anything of it? Yeah, that's the okay, thing. Gotcha. Though, like- then, then I got you. I got you. Two best points I've seen. <laughs> and two things that I, they, two great points. Um, Masvidal and Covington literally just had a fight for 25 minutes, five rounds. Um, you had all your chances to beat the shit out of this dude. And you didn't, to be quite honest. Um, so they're saying... Or, so yeah, I mean, you've already you already fought him, right? So the, it's kind of a the one perspective that's kind of a bitch move to go find him outside of a bar and run up on him and then just bounce again, right? Other point, Kobe Covington was saying some wild shit about this dude's family, his wife, his kids, 
airing out a lot of shit, right? Um, a lot of personal shit. Um, so I can see how Miles Vidal might take that personally because it is personal. Um, and then want to retaliate because for him, it might be that this shit's never did. Like, I don't care if I just fought you. We are enemies for life. And anytime I see you, you're getting fucking punched in the face. So I can see both sides. Whereas, whereas he just lost the fight in the cage. Um, so that should be it. And like, you had your chance. Well, well you said, um, well, I can't kind of give my opinion. I'm, if Kobe was talking shit, then I guess like he deserves to like, to know I, I, that there's a chance like he, he's obviously going to get up and try to fight you and shit. Yeah. I, again. Um, you can't go and provoke somebody and, it, and if you that part is bitch shit for sure. Wait, what part? The provoking? Where you, yeah. When you provoke somebody and like. And then, oh, you're and the innocent then party. Act innocent. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. You but can't, it, you can't poke the bear and then, like. Yeah. Okay. Bro, I remember. But they're evenly matched. Too, I remember so back in the really day, like, we saw something like, wasn't Kobe Covington is the guy that's like a really big Trump supporter. Trump supporter, right? yeah. So I remember that's him exactly. because of that. But I remember there was an interview about him, how the UFC wanted to get rid of him oh, because yeah. he wasn't necessarily entertaining. Yeah. So to me, like, I'm just trying to retract that and understand why he does all that. Right, because I'm sure he's not the only one that he talks shit about. Right, no, he talks shit about everyone in every single fight, everyone. every every yeah. single person. Right, yeah. So I think to me, like he's just that's just bluffing. his character. Oh no, it's like, it's it's all it's all to create to see, sell tickets to do all that shit. But I get you. The, if someone's talking about my mom, yeah. and, but and you come on, you're gonna do something. I might it, I might be a little upset, bro. Not to, to, because that's personal. That, that and that's point. why you know the online bullying thing, right? If you say some, uh, not even that, but if, if you're tough online. Right? Yeah. It's real easy to be tough online to say, I'm going to beat this dude's ass or blah, mm -hmm. blah, blah, or say some wild shit. But then when I see you and you're not really about it, you're not really all of a sudden like, oh, you don't see me. Like, oh, you just walk by me? Like, yeah. really? Like, you're just being tough online. And that'll usually be the case is that so motherfuckers going to be like, oh, this was like, what are we doing? Right? But someday you're going to come across the wrong person who sees that you're being tough online to them and you're going to have to see them. And it's going to be the wrong dude or, or girl, and they're going to do something. Yeah. And you can't be mad at that. Just because, oh, just because everyone else let it go. It, oh, now, why would you react like that? Well, yeah. you found the wrong guy to do this to. Exactly. You found the wrong girl to do this to. And I feel like that's what happened is that he's been doing this to everybody. Um, Usman, for example, his, his two fights, he said some wild shit about his dad. Um, he's been very personal to a lot of people. And I think everyone just took it like how you're saying. Oh, just a character. And you're right. Pretty much his character. That doesn't mean it's okay. And I think he has come across the wrong fucking person to do it. And this motherfucker said, whatever you say. It's on site. It's on site. And I, he's taking it literally. Yeah. And I get, again, <laughs> no, yo, if you're talking about your family, oh, yeah, bro. your girl, um, your kids, you got you to gotta take that. Same thing. That's why when the, the Conor McGregor thing happened and how um, Kobe went over the cage to find he wasn't done. Um, I got that because this motherfucker was saying some crazy shit about his religion, about his um, dad, about his everything, about him. He was being wildly dark, right? Yeah, bro. Um, so I can understand why Khabib would I say, I understand Fuck both sides, this dude. And not only that, like, I get it. They kind of hashed, they, because, I mean, did they hash it out in the cage? Probably not. No. But again, like, this goes further out than just yeah, profession, bro. Exactly. Like, this is personal. Um, like, I'm trying to fuck you up at this point. Because uh, it's one, I guess. For example, the the lead up to the fight, right? Um, you can there's an argument to be made that Kobe made it personal. He brung in his wife, his kids, and shit like that. So if you do that, um, even if it's a character, even if it's just a, for show, you gotta accept the consequences if there are any. Mm -hmm. For example, if someone says, "I'm going to uh, bomb so and so," or "I'm going to kill the, you know, leader of the the world," whether you are bluffing or not. Someone's taking that very seriously, yeah. right? You can't go in an airport. Even if, if you go in an airport and say, I'm going to bomb the plane, you could be bluffing, but that doesn't matter. They're gonna, yeah. They'll come for you. TSA is going to remove your TSA, ass and put you yo, on the no-fly list. Thank you. Put you in jail, probably. If you're in Washington, D.C., right, mm -hmm. um, and you send out a text saying you want to do so-and-so to the president, I think there's about a 100% chance that within the next 24 hours, someone's going to show up at Someone's showing up at your door. Even you can say, no, no, but it's just, I'm just bluffing. I'm just a character. I'm just playing. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. Don't say that shit. Yeah. <laughs> so exactly. that's the correlation I'm trying to, or that I have made, I guess. Yeah. Is that, yeah, you might be playing a character. It might be all fun. You're uh, to build the fight, blah, blah, blah. 
All right, well, that doesn't mean there's any consequences to mm-hmm. that. Whether you're playing a character or being fake or not, like now you got to answer to it. Yeah. Because I'm the wrong guy. To, and Mosvet always is the wrong guy to do that to. He we've looks seen. pretty fucking scary. Not even He that. looks like the guy that I wouldn't fuck around with, <laughs> like outside of but any he's, he's done other shit, though. Like the one time, uh, remember the, the Leo, what's his, Leon Edwards? Leon Edwards. They were in a, after Masvidal's fight, he won a fight, I think, versus Darren Till. And backstage, that dude was saying some wild shit to him. And he came over to him, hands behind his back. And um, I guess Leon, like, kind of fainted. He just fucking <laughs> went off on him in backstage just for that. Yeah. For saying some crazy shit and whatever. So you know that this guy is willing to do some crazy shit. Oh, yeah. And then you're going to go ahead and talk about his kid. And, like, you got to eat that. And not only that. Press charges afterwards? Pre- I think the pressing charges shit is crazy. You're a yeah. professional fighter. And you if you decide to say some crazy shit about this dude, then you got to fucking hold that. Yeah, Hold that L. Take it with you. This, and this, is my with point. this was kind of my point to Mikey that one time about the Kashi thing. You, you were saying all this shit. You know, you were saying you were so-and-so. And yeah, everyone. Oh, but every, it's clear that he's... All right, well, you, just because it's clear... That you're not that type of person, you still said these things, and people still take you seriously. Maybe be careful what you say, or somebody's yeah. gonna do something. You can't yeah. be mad at somebody. And not only that, like this for Kobe, he can be entertaining in other ways. That's that, that was Masvidal's point. Is that yo? There are other ways to sell fight. Yeah. Um, I don't. He was he was pretty much saying I want to beat the shit out of this dude, so people know that it's not cool to bring up people's kids and families yeah. to build a fight. That that's not cool. Yeah. Right. And. Uh, I obviously earlier said like there is no fine, there's no line to me, but the people, some people have lines, especially in person. With this dude, they were face to face. This was online. Yeah, They're crazy shit to each other. So you gotta, you said some wild shit. You got, you might have to pay for it. You might not. Like Usman didn't do anything. He just accepted it, beat his ass, and moved on. Right. But let's say he did take it personally with his dad. Maybe on site every time he sees him. Now you got to answer for that. So be careful what you say. You know. Be careful. Be careful what, what you say. say. <laughs> Because sometimes it can come, like, same thing with me. <laughs> I edited that shit a certain way, and I got the reaction I wanted. Maybe a little <laughs> motherfuckers went a little too far. <laughs> Wanted me aborted, but, like, I got to eat that. Yeah. I did that shit on purpose. Same shit with him. He's doing this shit on purpose, so you got to eat that. Yeah. Um, let me see. Okay. Damn. Uh, last thing. <laughs> I just ready to go. <laughs> Male birth control. Quick thoughts. What's up? We might, we maybe we'll touch on it more with Wesley next week. Or we can just end this right now if you want. Yeah, I think we should just Good? touch it next week. So next week, Wesley? Okay, that's cool. Um, okay, guys. Uh, episode 59 of the LFP. Hector, thanks for being here. Yayo, no George. No fucking George. No Wesley. Damn. I, mean, I hope his dick is big. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit. Not for like me, but like for yeah, himself. I yeah, I know. I, I understood that. Yeah. <laughs> that was obvious. <laughs> was it? I don't know. <laughs> um was thank you guys for being here. Episode 59. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, we were definitely on one this one finally. Last one was our off week. Back to being on. Build the momentum. Listeners, everyone love you. Until next week. Love, love you. Huh?